is this shyster? What is that intro? So strange. New game. It's funny when a girl tells her story only to be told back that it's unrealistic. Almost as if they're afraid to believe it's real. For everyone who doesn't know, my mom's a bitch, my dad shot himself, my life sucks, and my brother's on a watch list. Not in that order, or, or maybe, I don't know. But last year, that combination left me at the worst, most predatory school imaginable. At least I thought it was the worst school. But then I, like, talked to other people, and it turns out it wasn't that bad. Well, no, it was that bad. It was just really standard. Other girls saying their gym teacher wanted to bang them. Their counselor texting them at 3 in the morning. I was the only one with a white nationalist photography teacher, though, so I guess that's something. But here's the point. He was a white Mom nationalist. The principal doesn't care, and I still have all of senior year to get through. My life's just a game. A sick, hopeless game. Like, I've never really been religious, but if God is some introvert loser sitting in their computer chair, I really hope they can help me through oh. this. I mean, I only got two endings. Hey, you're on time. I'm already so fucking over this. Oh, it's the same character. Okay. All I said was hi. I wish I was hi. Do you think I'm here this early by choice? What is it this time? I'm still awake from last night because my mom accidentally took one of my brother's Adderalls. Instead of what? I don't know, like oxy or morphine or something. They give old people heroin pills to mellow out over gas prices. Really? Do those pills even look the same? Anyway, so she won't shut the fuck up over how many days I missed. I'm like, mom, if I can't go to sleep, I'm gonna miss another day. Well, wasn't she right? You're here early for the first time in forever. Oh my god, it's like I'm talking to a guy. Can't you just agree with me and say, yeah, she's a bitch? Okay, sorry, Nicole. Your mom is a bitch fucking whore. What's up, whores? So now I feel better. This is why we have friends. We're really white. Uh, oh, guys, what's up? Wait, Did I tell you I got an iPhone they're for my white? birthday? That's, uh, that's cool. We talked to you like once a month. Oh. Well, yeah, it's crazy because, like, I didn't know iPhones could do this much, bro. Thanks, Sal. Do you kill an Asian child, or is that just when it's being made? That's, uh, nah, but, like, there's all these cool apps. Like, I know there's YouTube and stuff, but there's <laughs> apps where you can, like, shoot guns and pop bubbles and stuff. You mean games? It, it's not even, like, games. It's, it's just apps. Like, there's an app for this, there's an app for that. Is there an app that'll make you fuck off and kill yourself? Um, is that, like, a choke, or are we... Just go! That alone was way too much in the morning. There's no way I'm getting through these classes. Are you gonna skip again? What choice did he just leave me? I can't see anyone like him for the rest of the day, or I'm gonna go insane. Come on, let's go somewhere. Uh -huh. I have a quiz today, Nicole. Oh, you're gonna miss your Scantron memory game? Just retake your Oh my god, your Scantrons. <laughs> Fine. So where are we even going? We're going to the mall, bitches. Why did we come here if we don't even know what we want to buy? Because we're hanging or mall core. Just figure it out. Even mall if I kids. do want something, it's just torture. I have like no money. Who said we're buying anything? Just steal the shit. Oh, okay. You think they have MSI stuff here? The band? Yeah, they're all in my shuffle and they might be in town this MSI Mid season in invitationals? Oh. Is there a problem? No, I'm just surprised you like MSI because you're so normal. Bitch, I could cut myself just as much as you do. I just have better <laughs> shit to do, okay? That's not how it. Uh, okay, so what are we getting? I want a CD and a shirt if they have one. It's one or the other. And beside like, GPU? You don't steal twice in the same trip. The only people here is us and some dad buying Skechers. Who do you think the security guy is going to have more fun gawking at? He wouldn't look at us. We're like children skipping school. Oh, those children are so hot. How many men do you need to see outed as sex offenders before you start so seeing So do the teachers trend? get fired? You know what? Pick for me, Nicole. Lead the way. Steal a $10 shirt. This place always smells like plastic. Hey, how you guys doing today? Brody? Wait! Holy shit, are you skipping too? I dropped out, my mom forced me oh. to get a job. So fucking not straight, I know. Okay, well, wait, how the fuck do you drop out? Uh, Is this it's hot a lot of paperwork. You thinking about it too? 
That's okay. Yeah, you're the guy in the PBS commercials they make fun of. Oh, the tiny wallet commercial? Yeah, it's like 80% of dropouts. What's like, a tiny wallet? I, I don't know, the TV said you suck, so fuck you. Yeah, right. Do you guys get paid eight an hour to go to that bitch idiot school? <laughs> <laughs> wow, you thought that would impress us. Yeah, you're dumb, white, and broke. Shut the fuck up, you albacore-eating bitch. Hey, whoa, what? where's your manager? What? You can't What's talk wrong to customers eating like albacore? that. Apologize, wage slave. God damn it, fine, sorry. Good. Now what sizes do you have MSI shirts in right now? The band, uh, I think everything but large? Damn, that's the one size she Wait, wears Wait, what's wrong eating albacore? for us? What you see out is what we have, dude. If you don't check right now, I'm gonna tell your manager you didn't say hi to us when we walked in. Fuck, fine. Joke's on you, bitches. I'm just gonna go back and pretend to look. <laughs> okay, grab the smallest. Classic. Yeah, I was like, how the fuck do you think I'm a large? Come on. Oh. Go, go, go. How'd you learn how to do that? What do you mean, learn? You can't just take the shit in front of him. Okay, so what's next? Uh, we leave before we get caught? We can't leave now, that was such a rush! Come on, let's go to the food court and steal some Dairy Queen. I really like Dairy yourself? Queen fries when I was yeah, a kid. Yeah, I guess it'd be pretty hard to jump the counter and fill a cone without spilling it. No, that shit's easy. Why would you risk getting caught over Dairy Queen? Should we try Sarku Japan, or would the free samples lady chase after us? Literally anywhere but here, come on. Oh god, I ate way too much. This is no way we can run out on the check now. How do what is this? people eat here? It's like pure sodium. Fuck, answer this my looks familiar. Question. You wanted the patty melt. Since we're not paying for this either, I figured I'd demo some other part of the menu. It's oh, it's just a diner. It's just oh. a burger where your mom forgot to buy buns. Who would voluntarily pay for that? Someone who butters margarine with butter? You think we got Trody fired today? I don't know. I don't care either. Weird. Most of our you graduated high school in 09. Arrow. This is crazy like, accurate. So you had pedophile like teachers? Yeah. Almost like he has to deal with the consequences of his actions or something. Since when do you, of all people, worry about accountability? I don't worry about it for my actions. I'm too smart for consequences. It's the one time I feel kind yeah, of Yeah, I guess everybody has at least one pedophile teacher. Pole dancing. Yeah, if I was dumb as shit, being a stripper would be awesome. Though I'd feel ripped off because I learned how to read for nothing. What if you're too shy and just work at Hooters? Dude, Hooters is even worse than a club. It's a legalized brothel. What? How? How do you know this? My cousin works at one. She says half the girls blow dudes for like $300 tips and then wonder why they're getting stalked the next week. That's really, really specific. That really happens. So what's next? I think I want to go back to school now. Dude, you know you're going to end up sitting there bored. I'd rather do that than end up the dick-sucking girl at Hooters. You can just say girl at Hooters. The dick-sucking's implied. Check, please. I thought, I thought you only have to. Leave. I thought they only hire big titty people Strolling for Hooters. Strolling at noon together. You girls had a busy morning. Yeah, you don't know the half of it. Not even a quarter, if we're being honest. Well, the sign-in sheet is on the desk. The unexcused column. I think you know it all too well, Nicole. Unexcused? Yeah, we kind of miss class for very traumatic reasons. Yeah, trauma has to be one of the excused hardies, right? For some reason, I don't believe you. But today, I think that's your problem. It's being a fucking bitch your problem? <gasps> Excuse me. Oh my god, it was the trauma. I'm so sorry. So why don't you both enlighten me oh, to she's the source of this Lacoste. trauma that's caused absence after absence? What? Uh, okay, you're gonna want to take a seat. I've heard it all, Nicole. Uh, no, you really haven't heard whatever she's about to tell you. Go on. We just came from the doctor and we, um, we tested positive for HIV. We did? We, we did. And the nurse told us we might be AIDS positive because we went so long without treatment. We won't get the results till later We though. both have it. You both went to get tested together at the same place? Yeah. And where was that? Like the, like the Springfield Clinic? And you expect me to just believe this, shouldn't you? Think about it, Miss Lynn. If you believe us and we're lying, it's just a little prank. But if we're telling the truth and you don't believe us, you're gonna have to explain that to the local news. And we'll have to explain that to the national news. How our principal made us cry while we're literally dying from AIDS. I, I need to see some documentation, girls. Do you realize the odds? How would you even get HIV Are we going to court over school? this again? We didn't get it in high school. What? Yeah, it's kind of embarrassing, but we go to a lot of swinger parties with homeless people. What? Homeless swinger parties. Yeah. And it's TMI, but I have a, 
unprotected sex fetish, so it all kind of adds up. What? Yeah, and I have a sex in general fetish. What? Small world, one of my... 30 boyfriends has that too. What? 30 boyfriends? Oh yeah, when a Dominican construction worker cat calls me, just immediate relationship. Yeah, I love Jekka, but she's a major whore. I what? So you both got your results for <laughs> HIV? Did the blood work and everything? Yeah, that's what we said. What's your T-cell count? Uh, I, I don't get it. We don't take shop. You don't take shop? Yeah, they use T-cells in shop class. What's that have to do with AIDS? That's a T-square, Nicole. Fuck! What? No, if what? you knew, why'd you look at me? <laughs> I didn't know how much we were supposed to say. How the fuck would I know? You said we had AIDS. It all comes oh, out. Oh, fuck. And coincidentally, I okay, have a she lovely caught us in the lie. to spend your Saturday afternoon. Or you're fuck. expelled. This sucks. My bad. This really sucks. We're almost set up here, but thank you to everyone for coming to the AIDS Awareness Speaker. <laughs> we have about 10 guests here with their journeys to share, and we hope you can all learn a lot from them. I could be at the MSI show right now, but now I can't because I listen to you. Oh, don't say that. Don't say we have AIDS when you don't know what the fuck a T-cell is. Like she was supposed to believe you had a Rolodex of 50 guys? What's a, is that like a Pokédex? It was stupid, and she didn't ask about T-cells until after you said that. 30 guys, what are you, a public restroom? Whatever. Why is AIDS such a big deal anyway? Isn't Magic Johnson Magic like the healthiest Johnson. man on earth? Huh? Magic Johnson? He got AIDS like 20 years ago and he's fine. Who's Magic Johnson? Is that a porn star? I don't think so. My dad talks about him a lot. You don't think your dad could like a male porn star? <laughs> Nicole, I'm already here. I don't need to also have a crisis over whether have my dad's the... gay or not, okay? The, the... Hey, did you get an email quiz from Miss Lynn? About the Saturday thing? Yeah, I was almost late filling it out. What is that like, shirt? It wasn't for us to just go. She had to know we were there somehow. Yeah, but if she wasn't there, how would she know we're telling the truth? She could record the assembly and play it back later. But then just record the crowds, which shows we went there. Female teachers are fucking insane. It's all about a power trip. And the male teachers? Pedophiles. Pedophiles. How'd you know what I was gonna say? I'm noticing a trend. No, vote for Pedro shirts were a trend. The other thing's just forever. Okay, well, I'm gonna go to class now. Are you going this time? Why? To not get forced to go to an AIDS assembly again? That didn't happen because we skipped. That happened because we lied about why we skipped. Well, okay. Are you looking for a classroom or another excuse right now? When did that movie like, come God, out? You sound like my mom. Whatever. See you later. Hey, Nicole. You got a minute? I Who's this? I have a whole life ahead of me. Doesn't mean this I'll a new character. To to you. Oh, totally. But, I, I mean, nah. You see, I was asking around and wondered if you wanted to go to the Knife Collector Show, the Expo Center. Why the fuck would any girl want to go do that with you? Uh, no, it's not like a date. It's, uh... But yeah, how are you? <laughs> are you a human text message? Um... Uh, Is that the alert that you're typing? Sorry, it's just kind of hard to talk to you. Good. So what you doing today? Uh, art class. <laughs> For this week's assignment, let's oh, this really is a new open guy. the floor of creativity. In the medium of newsprint and charcoal pencil, we're gonna draw a few characters. We're gonna draw a newspaper? It's like newspaper without the ink. What the fuck did my mom pay a $50 supply fee for for drawing <laughs> a newspaper? Yeah, isn't that cheaper than printer paper? It's not cheaper, it's just specialized. Okay. Art classes are here to remind you you're special. So are homeless people special when they eat out of the garbage? <laughs> Your minds are special. Do your kids really say <laughs> this in high school? I guess we are if we took this class. And with the medium of newsprint and charcoal pencils, we'll be drawing characters. Any I guess characters I went to a really nice like. school. These characters could tell a story, show how you feel, portray a social cause, Anything you feel depends is on the worth school the prep, time probably. Can my characters murder bitches? <laughs> be mindful that anything we do in this class must be school appropriate. Can my characters be the gym teacher trying to molest us? Nicole. <laughs> what? It's in school. I True. think you're all smart enough to know what pushes the envelope. It's your first assignment. Just play it safe. Any other questions? Are we allowed to just draw people hanging out? Of course, though it might not be the strongest test of your creativity. Think, why are they hanging out? What purpose brought them all together to hang out? God, bitches and shit. If there are no further <laughs> questions, I'll hand you your Seriously? papers and we can begin. Fuck 
drawing. Wait, draw. This is gonna suck ass. Yeah. I'm sensing some negativity Thanks, over here, girls. Bro. It's negative to think your class is a waste of time. That's not negative, it's just accurate. Yeah, like you're gonna fail us if we're bad at drawing. I'll fail you if you're bad at giving effort. So there's no tangible achievement in this class. That's fucking stupid. Watch the language. Watch The Office. The Office? The TV <laughs> show? Yeah, it's for people who aren't funny. You'll love it. Hey, I like The Office. So yeah, why do we have to draw and paint? It's our last year of high school. You're never too old for creativity. We don't know what we're doing. We're just finger painting with brushes. I want to see well, what she's drawing. If you drawing. put the effort in, maybe you'll learn what you're doing. Or maybe I'll have to fail you for the year. No, I'll do it. It's just dumb as shit. Next terrorist attack better be in art school. Yes, and Nicole, can I trust you'll participate? Can I trust the housing market? Your friend's doing it. Why? Wait, not what year is it? <laughs> she wants to go to college and shit. I just want to hang out and get fucked up. I think it's 2009. <laughs> so you won't be participating. Nope. Oh, then yeah, 09. Nice. It's in the title. My teaching assistant for the year. And what's that entail? Cleaning brushes, organizing supplies, and posting to our MySpace pages. Why would you put any of this on MySpace? Online networking is the future. Uh, what if one of you kids went viral and spun a career out of it? Have you heard of Owl Town? You mean Owl City? <gasps> Either way, in the arts, we embrace the future. And MySpace is that future. Welcome aboard, Owl Nicole. Town. Oh my god. Is that excitement I hear? Fine, I'll Would do you a little baby drawing, okay? To the eyes. best of your ability. Oh yeah. He seems we'll nice. See. Your hand's covered in that weird charcoal stuff. Yeah, I washed my hands for like Why two minutes. Why is he minutes, he's got a Punisher off. shirt on? Yeah, Does he not like anime so anymore? Do you like drawing or whatever? No, I was just randomly placed in it. The kids who actually wanted to be there are so annoying too. Uh. I like taking art class. Mr. Lori's the best. See? No, I see. See what? I gotta work on my lab. I'll see you later, Nicole. You're going what through an me? edgy phase? God, I drew for an hour and then in two days, I'll have to draw for another hour. What's so bad about drawing? Jeffrey, just do the lab. Well, no, what's wrong with it? Or do you not like Mr. Lori? Uh, both? Oh, I wish more people understood him. He's been through a lot this year in his home life. How would you know? What? He's a teacher. They don't tell us anything. I have lunch in his classroom because no one sits with me in the cafeteria. We talk about a bunch of stuff like his house foreclosing and his wife cheating on him and- Wait, wait, wait. Cheated on him? With who? It was, um, I think this might have been private. I don't know if I should tell you. No, come on. I can't. Come on, Jeffrey. Don't was it a male student? Happy? Oh, uh, yeah. So you go ahead and tell me, okay? It was the UPS man. What? <laughs> Holy shit. What? From teacher to mailman? He's so bad of a husband that she's fucking down. You're not gonna tell anyone, are you? Jeffrey, don't you trust me? Uh, okay, I trust you. Thank you. She's fucking down? Yeah, he's pathetic, right? What if she's just really ugly? When you're ugly, all you can do is fuck down. Yeah, but she still cheated. It takes a lot for an ugly woman to cheat. Oh, totally. Mr. Lori had to have been into some terrible shit. But what, though? Sup, bitches. Who invited you? <laughs> me, motherfucker. You guys want to go to the fair with me this weekend? The fair? Yeah, with, like, games and shit. Is it 1920? Why would I go to the fair? Yeah, we have internet and Xanax. Fuck the fair. Ooh, so internet and Xanax. is a cool year. You would like a year where rape was legal. Rape was not legal in 1920. In practice, it was. God, shut up. There's cool shit to do there. They don't even card you. Honestly, it's your loss. Hey, whoa, what's going on? Chill with the yelling. Leave me oh, alone, bro. No, don't be Jesus. A bitch. Don't make me fight you. Dude, what? Don't be lame right now. Why are you still here? Me? No, both of you. I was just trying to, like, he, he was kind of going at you. We're not going to fuck either of you. Oh, whatever then. Yeah, no. Dude, um, nobody in my high school ever talked that, about fucking. Everybody. Speaking of every week, are you still watching Real Housewives Atlanta? Nah, no, I got tired of it. Is it bad now? Things no, will just cheat. every commercial on Bravo is like, guess which celebrity is gay? We got him this time. It's annoying. For the gay channel, it's kind of homophobic. Yeah, I only watch at midnight. Did I go to private school? No, it was a public. Do you think they pay well? Who, Bravo? No, Girls Gone Wild. There's oh. my artist. Hello, girls. Oh, God. Let's keep the conversations to inside the classroom. Oh, I won't be long. I just wanted to compliment your effort today, Nicole. At first, he seems nice. But then, sinking your teeth into the assignment more than anyone. Good showing. Thanks, Mr. Laurie. I look forward to the final product. 
beautiful girls make beautiful pictures. Right, girls? But it's a mirror photo. I'll see you on Okay, that was a little weird. What a fucking weirdo. What's his problem? <laughs> I think he's a tiny bit into you. Cool, another child predator. You've literally said that about that was every weird. guy teacher here. Well, it's literally true. You still have a dad, so they don't go for you as much. Really? Yeah, sexual father figure is like top five male fantasies. Right after murder. Really? Oh, and if they hook up with you, there's no angry dad to kick their ass over it. Exactly. So you could be prettier, but I'm way more desirable. I've had my fair share of guy teachers flirt with me. I just don't jump to all of them wanting sex. Well, no, not all of them. Just like 90%. That high? Yeah, I'm pretty sure like 90% of men have the urge to sexually murder teenage girls. Anyone who opposes that is probably like some ugly white guy who gets mad at video games. Is that a thing? <laughs> Is that a thing? I wonder if Jamie Lynn had that baby yet. Excuse me, Nicole? First week of school and your friends are already pregnant. What? No, Mom. Jamie Lynn Spears? I don't care who her parents are. I Wait, don't want you hanging around Britney's girls who make bad decisions. A little late sister? for that. This is a new year and I want you to start it off right. As if I did last year wrong? Oh, let me count the ways. Far too many for a number. Yeah, right. Name one incident. The time you dated your gym teacher? I needed money, that doesn't count. Then how about when you caused a boy to get locked in the psych ward? It's not my fault I'm beautiful, Mom. I didn't know it was common for beautiful girls to ask for a gallon of their partner's blood. If they're beautiful Wait, okay. and hot, absolutely. Slay? Okay, then explain the time you set a Palmia flag on fire in the cafeteria. It was funny. I don't even know what that Honestly, means. Answer that for all of them. It's excuse after excuse. You're driving me crazy with your bullshit, Nicole! I just got the fuck home. Can we do this later? Another excuse! Get your shit together and we won't have this problem! What shit? I'm fine. Stop lying. Aww. Quit shoplifting. Don't talk back to your teachers and fix your fucking drug problem. What drug problem? What are you talking about? Stay out of my medicine cabinet, Nicole. Mom, you are so fucking paranoid right now. Am I? You wouldn't mind if I looked in your backpack, would you? I would mind, but you wouldn't find shit anyway. Because you did it all at school, right? What is this, the Salem Ho trials? You have two <laughs> options, Nicole. Live by the rules of society or live on the goddamn street. Right now, your schoolwork is the only thing keeping you here. <laughs> no. You wouldn't kick me out. I can do whatever I want. Except find a good husband, right? Shut your fucking mouth. The MILF window's closing, Mom. Oh, I want to hit you so bad right now. Where's my balance? Top shelf on the left. Why do I say we? When Wait, I she does go in her medicine things? cabinet. Hold on. What are you drawing? Can I see? No, no, not yet. Surprise. I don't know what you're drawing for this class, but it better be really good if you care this much. We're graded on effort. I wonder if art studios hire based on effort. No. Oh, I just finished my drawing. What'd you draw? Bitches getting killed. Women dying <laughs> is cool. You should move when you graduate. Unfortunately, the deadline for your character drawings has come. I will now walk around to provide feedback and collect your artwork. Jekka? Oh, here. Care to explain the piece to me? It's me and Ryan Sheckler at the Warp Tour. Ryan Sheckler? Yeah, bitch, he's sexy. That's an unlockable character in Tony Hawk. He's not even real. You are really <laughs> fucking stupid. Watch the language, Nicole. Fuck, sorry. I mean, shit, sorry. I mean... Whatever. And now I'm very <laughs> interested to see yours. Are you sure? Oh, you Tony Hawk must it, have been huge. With the class. Back you then. You say so. This is. What is this? Oh, it's a picture of you killing yourself while your wife blows the UPS man. <laughs> what? How? Where'd you get this information? Oh my god, I'm so sorry. Was it FedEx? Wait! This isn't funny, Nicole. I think he's nice. <laughs> Insubordination, inappropriate imagery, and sexual harassment of faculty. I'll let Principal Lin handle you. I'm sorry. Oh, sexual no. harassment? That's precisely what this is. There's nothing sexy about you. It's just regular harassment. <laughs> that's that's kind of true. This bitch better have some Valium left. Expelled? Guess not. I told you you were on thin ice and what'd you go and do? What the fuck are you talking about? You really think they'd refer you to the board for expulsion without giving me a phone call? The fuck you mean expelled? I got suspended, thank you. Suspended indefinitely. Yeah, indefinitely. Meaning not definite, like not for sure. Meaning until they know what to do with you. That's how much trouble you're in. I've never in. been suspended. Fucking whatever. It's not a big deal, mom. They you always have to be very this. bad. And what if they follow through? 
I don't know. It's not even your problem. Just fuck off. So I take it you're not my problem either. Definitely not. Fine. As I was tonight, a good student. No I showed here. my report what? card before. Literally like 95% average. Go drink some wine. You're such a bitch when you're sober. <gasps> Get the fuck Let's have a Salem whole trial. Are you serious right now? Like, come on. Should I call the police? You know what? Do it. God damn it. What is that? Hurry up. I texted like uh, five minutes friend's ago. Friend's house? Okay, what the hell is going on? Do you still have that futon in your basement? Yeah, it's covered in dried Mr. Pib, but yeah. I guess that's What? Fine. What is Mr. Sleeping? Pib? Tonight? No, bitch. Tomorrow. Are you really getting expelled over that drawing? That's bullshit. Just tell your mom that. I'm oh, done soda. My mom okay. She can rot in a tanning bed for all I care. Well, you're gonna rot in the street. I thought if she you was talking about cum. Dude, you have a house. Just let me stay with you. If it was my house, you could stay all you want, but it's my parents' house. Mom will get pissed. That'll probably hit on you. It'll be weird. Okay, so you and your dad against her. That's perfect. Let me stay. No, Nicole. Like, I wish I could help, but I don't know. Was I like well, this? Can you at no. Least give me all the fruit roll ups in your kitchen. <sighs> I'll be right back. I mean, the internal thoughts are pretty close Wonder to a which high mall schooler. Has the softest benches. You would Those internalize these thoughts. You would not say these out loud. Homeless customers. Damn, Nicole, you're here early. Yeah, you too. What for? Just buying something. Buying what? Are you a cop? Bitch, do I look like a cop? Yeah, just waiting for Kyler. He's supposed to sell me his oxy. He's got a lot, right? Totally. These dumbass white guys break their legs and turn into pharmacies. I'd buy more from him, but then I'd have to give him my phone number. Hey, Wait, don't. so they get make a ghost injured account. A ghost and then... Account. Or they call it a burner or a puppet. Basically an account separate from you where you do illegal shit. Oh, I think I already have one of those. <laughs> I went to what school with Dash. She purposely shit in me. class. Kind of a waste. You have no. the right people. You can buy anything on there. Drugs, guns, ass, whatever. Buy ass? Guns and ass. And the cops aren't tracking that? No, they're old ass cops. They can't figure that shit out. Cool. Buy yeah, ass? this is good to hear because my mom kicked me out yesterday. I should buy something to forget about this shit. Are you couch surfing or straight up homeless? Homeless straight up. I slept on a bench last night. Ooh, Damn. stinky. Well, go make some money on MySpace. But I don't have any drugs or guns to sell. Oh, no. You know what I meant. She's going to sell Ugh. ass? I don't know if I'm ready to be a MySpace escort. Have you never thought about it before? No, I think about it every week. I do just never not thought I'd have this ass. crossroad in high school. Shit happens, dude. I wouldn't think any less of you. Yeah, but would I think less of myself? Yo, what's up? I, I got the shit. Where the fuck were you? Places? I got shit to do. I'm not some drug addict like you. They're not for me. They're for my boyfriend. You have a boyfriend? I don't even want to sell this <laughs> to you anymore. Are you kidding me? I got a hundred for the bottle right here. 110. You said 100 on MySpace, asshole. Yeah, but you didn't say you had a boyfriend. Fuck me. Okay, 110, here. Thanks. And, and let me know when you're single. Let me know when you're not. What? Have fun. No what? Well. I'll try. <laughs> Gotta get home before Mind of Mencia comes on. What's Hello, that? I have a pill. I don't have a boyfriend. Panhandling pills? What are you, homeless? Uh, no. Oh, good. Yeah, you can have one, because I fucking hate the homeless. Okay. Seriously, <laughs> like a lot of politicians just say that, but I actually want homeless people exterminated off the planet. Yeah, but that's an opinion. Like the only way they could contribute to our society is by jumping in a meat grinder so we have something to feed farm animals. Give me the fucking pill. Whoa, fine. Are you like an addict? You could say that. Sweet, yeah. Drug addict girls are hot because they're really easy to control. Jesus Christ. What? Oh, uh, I think Mind of Mencia is starting soon. Oh, you're right. I, I gotta go. This guy is okay, such a guy. I gotta figure something out. Um. Start your own car wash. In a hardware store alone. Now I know how it feels to be racist. Oh, hey, Nicole. Huh? Uh, oh, wait. It's not awkward. Uh, what's awkward? Usually when I see someone from school in public, I, don't get I try it. to avoid them. But I just realized I'm not in school anymore. Did you drop out? No, I'm getting expelled. For what? Some bullshit. Don't worry about it. Okay, yeah. Well, at school, stuff's been going good for me. Did you know where the sponges are? I'm trying to start a car wash. Oh, my dad supplies, bought a scrub daddy. I'm still class president. Could you not interrupt me? I'm not in class anymore. You're not my president. Well, I'm still a person, so you should respect me. Dude, I'm out of high school. You're just a memory now. There's zero consequences for anything I say to you. Are you even- You're a whore. 
Excuse me? I have a boyfriend and a purity ring. For real? How do I get one? A little late for you. No, it's never too late to have your boyfriend fuck every girl but you. I don't need to take this. I'm on the honor roll. What's it's a purity you'll ring? Never do. Bitch, why don't you shut the fuck up before I slit your throat and watch the honor roll out? Are you threatening me? No, I'm hitting on you. Flash me a titty, bitch. Cokehead slut! And there is no one she can report me to. Awesome. Hand wash for only eight bucks. Great deal. My nose is itchy. Hey, what's up? Uh, nothing much. Corolla you driver. What are you selling? Car washes, eight bucks. With one of those peanut sponges? Yeah, the big yellow one, hand washed. Get a car wash to support the homeless. With that sponge, fuck the homeless. <laughs> you drive a Corolla. What are you worried about? <laughs> Maybe I should flirt more. You washing cars? What is it? Look? Mustang I mean, driver. Yeah, and I'd really like to wash a car like yours. I bet it's <laughs> Fuck. fast. Yeah, 300 horsepower. Oh That's god, a it's a Mustang of driver. Of course not. It no. is what it is, right? <laughs> yeah, it's the GT, so leather seats and everything. Leather is so sexy. You want to take me for a ride after I get this cleaned? A ride where? I don't know. Your place, maybe? I don't think my husband would like that. <laughs> <laughs> Since when the fuck do gay people drive Mustangs? That's true. Mustang's spot. not a gay car. Teachers are charitable, right? Damn, you went 16 and a 10. Oh, hey, sweetie. What you doing here on a Saturday? I thought he's in jail. Car wash. Are you sure you're allowed to do that at school without staff supervision? I'm a student here. It's whatever. Are you sure you're allowed to go that fast? Ah, there's no kids around today. And even if I hit one, it's just a write-off. How is that a write-off? Because you write them off the student list. Wow, so you want a car wash? I might have some time. How much? Eight bucks. Get that shirt wet and I'll give you ten. I'm in high school, Mr. Colby. You're That's right, really you're cheap. Right. Fifteen, then. Not what I meant. Fifteen what? Years in prison at this rate. Nicole, what do you think you're doing here? She's a student. She could be here. Yeah, I know, right? She got expelled, Mr. Colby. What? Is this true? I didn't get expelled. I'm suspended indefinitely while they consider expulsion. Honey, you can't be here. You gotta go. Why? <laughs> or else what? Or I gotta report you for an unsanctioned car wash. <laughs> well, I'll report you for trying to buy a wet t-shirt car wash. Uh... Well, well, maybe we could just forget about all this. Oh, what? I didn't see anything. You were literally walking up as he said it. No, actually, as I recall, you were offering him a topless car wash. Right, Mr. Colby? Oh, uh, uh, oh, yeah. Are you actually fucking kidding me? Who's the whore now, Nicole? You Jesus bitches are fucked up. She is God, my a Jesus sucks bitch. on the phone. How do I make a new account? Wish. Oh, shit, what's up? Hey, what's good? I didn't know you drank coffee. Do you need to be I'm still somewhere? homeless. I don't need to be anywhere. It just tastes good. Are you still homeless? Basically. I'm trying to use the Starbucks Wi-Fi right now. Did you try what I told you about? No, I'm making the account for it now, though. What should my name be? I mean, something that just lets people know you're down, honestly. Pussy gotcha. galore. How about dirty little rental? Little slutty. All right, what about pierced princess? Hmm, I like the innuendo, super cute, but really emo. I got shit to be emo about, don't I? Yeah, true. But that's probably already taken, so put X's in the name. Okay, XX Pierced Princess XX. It's available. There you go. Damn, you went from, like, hesitant to making awesome screen names. What happened over the week? What about 39 like, Dash? I just came to grips with the fact that... When you're pretty, retail and escorting make you feel equally disgusting. Yeah, either way, you deal with hideous people against your will. So who do I X add? How do I even taken? know they're around X, here? X, There's one guy who's connected with everybody in the area. You add one, then the others Thanks start Val, hitting you up. And What's his name? Uh, Cream Pie Casanova 420. Cream Pie Casanova. Added. So when he accepts, just PM him and he'll shut you out. Cool, but how does it work? I don't have a car. When you're selling favors, they usually come to you. And if you let them pay you in drugs, you get way more for your time. Have you done this before? I'm on there, but I never sold favors. My friends in Laurel have, though. Damn, there's some white trash in Laurel, too. Would they get paid in drugs? Yeah, but only because they had people to sell to. Anyway, I gotta go. Is this Good what? Is this what MySpace God, this girls did in high school in 09? I guess if one of them kills me, it'll make my mom mad.
you know, for two weeks of being homeless, you don't really look that homeless. What, do you think everybody homeless wears a barrel with suspenders? No, but you're still so, like, clean and put together. The homeless dudes on the bus are covered in dried I can't believe my mom kicked me factory. out. A lot of the guys let me crash, use their shower, everything. Guys that you're meeting on... On MySpace, yeah. I never thought I'd ask this not as an insult, but... How's being a whore going? Escort? Or that... Whatever means... Money for sex? On MySpace, we don't call it sex. We call it favors. Really? So, what are the guys like? Are they really weird? Well, they're buying favors so obviously, but the actual doing it isn't even the worst part. It's after. What is it awkward? Uh, so after they finish, depending on the guy, you get this wide range of emotions from wanting to save you to wanting to kill you. What's in the middle? Wanting you to get out before their wife comes home. They're married? What if they get you pregnant, Nicole? There's upper favors and lower favors. I don't do lower what? favors. Those are for ugly girls. Shit. What do they pay if you're not giving it all up? There's not really a number, because I usually trade for drugs. Guys into this are like pharmacies. That better be some awesome shit if you're not getting paid. Oh, Lower is. is pussy? thousand dollars in free pills this week. Oh. Not free if you're doing favors for them. Let's not get that deep. But you're only doing this because you're homeless. For real? What I'm saying is being a regular hoe for actual cash would be better than where you are right now. Then you could get your own place, maybe. No shit. I ask for drugs because I can't do this sober. I can't beg sober. What the fuck? I can't fuck? starve sober. I was just and in I art class. I can't fuck a stranger What sober. happened? Yeah, but why not Death go to a women's shelter or something? Home. You can't have drugs in a women's shelter, which is the last place you want to be sober in. I guess. It's just a month ago I couldn't imagine you doing this. I could never Why do did I it's draw so my art teacher getting cooked oh, by the ago, ups man? I wasn't homeless. But when your mom kicks you Fuck. out and your friend won't let you stay with her, that kind of forces you to do shit you wouldn't normally do. Are you trying to guilt me right now? Art student to MySpace to whole pipeline. I gave you fruit roll-ups. What do you want from me? Fruit roll-ups. Those are good. <laughs> this is so much easier than phone MySpace. Let's see. I can only pay in cash if that's okay. Shit. I guess I have enough on me to get me through it. Also, please keep this to yourself. I have a high profile career and don't want this getting around. High profile means rich. And rich means blackmail money. But I can't hold up a camera phone in his face for the proof. This is the feds! Nicole, you're not allowed to use MySpace on the library computers. Karen, right? Do you know how to set up a timed photo on the sidekick? The phone? Don't change the subject. I'm the librarian assistant. You're gonna get me in trouble. Why can't we use MySpace? It's not an educational website. I learned how to break into a car on MySpace. How is that not educational? Rules are rules, Nicole. Oh, hoeing on MySpace on the library oh, computer. Dude, can you just act like a hot bitch for once? But I'm not a hot bitch. No, I... Your, um... Your glasses are cute. Just cute, though. Did I say cute? I meant hot. Like, sex for free hot. I don't know. I feel kind of nerdy wearing them, but contacts hurt my eyes. Nerdy? No, they're like really distinctive in a hot way. You could like be in Playboy with a quadratic formula tramp stamp. Tramp stamp? Like the back tattoo? Yeah, dudes could study it while hitting you doggy and shit. I'm allergic to dogs. Christ, whatever. <laughs> Karen, do you see what I'm saying? You're a hot bitch. Act like one. What are hot bitches supposed to act like? Hot bitches aren't worried about losing their depressing unpaid internship at the local library. Well, I guess you can use the computer for five more minutes, but then you really gotta log off. Close enough. So, how do I do a timed photo? Uh, okay, so you go to Only the hot camera bitches section, allowed. do new capture, then go over to flash and exposure settings. There's three Genshin voice okay, actors in this? angle should be good. Where is this guy? And I wonder how rich he's gonna be. He could be like a basketball player, or Steve Jobs, or the guy who invented Adderall. Oh, I think that's him. It's so dark, he probably can't even recognize me. Really? Hey, you weren't looking for favors, were you? Guilty as charged, pierced princess. What the fuck? 
you're not rich, you're Mr. Lori. Oh God. Oh you no. You're on that part of my space. Oh, Nicole, please don't. Oh no. That's why your wife left you. You kept paying for ass on the internet. No. Out here. Damn. I was hoping you were the guy from Transformers. <laughs> why, why, oh, they're trying to blackmail him. I thought you were be a celebrity, so Nicole had me hide with her camera phone. Oh, two witnesses. Why not just use the self timer? I couldn't figure it out. How long have you been doing this? Girls, please. I'm just very anxious. I popped three Zans and I'm still freaking out. How'd you think I feel? No, come on. Let, let's work something out here. Like what? No, fuck that. This dude got me expelled. He ruined my life. I'm sorry, Nicole. Just please don't tell anyone about this. You better pay up then. Starting at a thousand each. But on a teacher's salary. Oh, his house and foreclosed. House payment. Your house was foreclosed. What do you got to worry about? Bitch, take a loan out. Yeah, ask your wife for that UPS money. All right, fine. Fine. Uh, I'll go to the ATM if you promise to just not we tell anyone. We could just kill him. Oh, for sure. Yeah, trust me. We won't tell a soul. There really is three Genshin VAs? Damn, what, how much you know, did Genshin pay well, them? Four dollars? The I told Jekka. Jekka showed the photo to Miss Lin. Miss Lin informed the school board, and the school board deemed his accusation of me unreliable because he pays for sex. My mom got a call from the principal saying I'm back in school, so I'm not homeless anymore either. Everything just kind of worked out. Aside from all the trauma I got from selling my body, but whatever. Jekka was worried he'd get revenge on me because I snitched. You know, cardinal street rule. But honestly, Thanks, street Gekka. rules don't really <laughs> exist Gekka. when you're actually living on the street. Everyone's gonna have an opinion on what I did to survive. But let's see you homeless with no one to crash with. Those upper favors are gonna start sounding real convenient. Then again, you're probably not as pretty as me, so you'd only get paid for lower favors. Bend over, bitch. The Salem Ho Trials. Kinda, I mean, that ending was okay, but we're still homeless. Wait, where is, um... One. Oh, this is auto. Wait, wait, new game. I want to try. It's oh, she said she's not. Oh, I missed it. Story. Okay, wait, wait, wait. I want to try stealing the CD. Why would I know how to do? It? You were in the girl. Wait. Options. Wait, this is messed up. Uh, yeah, we learned how to tie knots. To go, go back, go back, go back. Ugh. Wait, wait, wait. Go back. Come to Brazil, down. New game. It's funny when a girl tells her story. Hey, you're on time. I'm already so fucking over this. All I said was hi. I wish I was hi. Do you think I'm here? Oh yeah, this, this is the same. I'm still awake from last. I did Will it kill an eight? <laughs> Fine. Okay. So where are um... we even going? Skip in school until wait. Go to the mall. Steal the CD. Why did we come here if we don't even know? What we do? I... You know what? Pick for steal me. Steal a CD in two thousand and eight. I always wonder if the big gaudy security tags are for show. They don't even reorganize Things, coffins, the CDs. Please. How am I supposed to find this? You're at FYE. What the fuck do you expect? What's FYE? Acknowledgement of the alphabet. Don't you have the songs on your eye touch? What do you even want a CD for? Collection. IPod you put them on touch. a shelf somewhere. Look at my CDs. Who's gonna want to look at your CD collection other than you? Guys who want me bad? See, they think they can manipulate me by pretending to care about my taste in music, but I'm actually uh -huh. manipulating them into learning about my favorite artists. When all along... I have no intention of fucking them in the first place. That's genius. That's girl math. Why is flaming lips in the M section? Wait, what is flaming lips? Shitty. Okay, I'll give it a try. Can you hurry up? I feel like we're 20 seconds away from a guy in a Spitfire shirt asking us what bands we like. Oh, just found it. So how do we sneak it out? Say that again, but just as loud so everyone in the store can hear. I don't do this all the time, Nicole. College stuff and major in shoplifting. Quick, come on. Uh-oh. Oh my god, that was such a rush. Yeah, spending money's for Wait, posers. that's it? Oh, it'll sound so good on my dad's stereo, too. I don't think I've ever heard a single person say stereo without dad in front of it. Well, yeah, stereos are for old people without iPods. Do you think we'll ever end up old I people with iPods? No, I don't even think doom. about being old. Yeah, I probably kill myself before that happens anyway. If you do, can you like leave a note on how you killed yourself in case I want to do it too? Dude, yeah, what are friends for? Yeah, because my mom was telling me about the Zodiac Killer and I don't think anyone's going to go out that cool again. Oh, is he the guy with the symbol notes? Oh my god, yeah. Ted Cruz. It would be cool to go out like that. 
think about it. Some infamous shadowy figure kills you and then writes to the news in code about how hot it was when you died. You probably say that about every girl he kills. Yeah, no, that's true. If he doesn't specifically say I'm his hottest victim, then fuck off. He can kill someone else. I get that. Do you think we're crazy for wanting that? No, we're just hot. These are hot girl problems. Totally. Should we leave before we get caught, or...? Yeah, let's go to the Chrome Diner. Oh, God! Since when are the scanners here? Looks like the jig is up, girls. God damn it! Caught over stealing a 1299 CD. I hope it was worth it. What band did you like so much, huh? Uh oh. She's not wearing this shirt. Dude, the CD was hers. She brought it from home to trade in. With the price label and security tag still on it? She collects, right? Yeah, they lose collector's value if you take those off. You girls are gonna need a better story than that. Um, can I save? Oh, save. Go back. Flirt or run? Run? Come on! What? Oh shit! A runner, free! <laughs> Shit! Maybe now you'll think twice about breaking the law. Wait, this is drawn really well. Bullets, so she'll think twice next time. Yeah, it could have been less, but I fired with my eyes closed. Little inside challenge down at the precinct. What? Are you actually fucking insane? You know, you remind me of my wife a bit. I want to fucking kill my wife! <laughs> what? Shut your mouth before I blow your fucking brains out on the tile floor! Oh, no, please don't. I'm sorry. Now that's more like. It. I'll call you girls an ambulance. One sec. You fucking shot me? But yeah. Do you want to go to my party this Saturday? I don't know. It's just kind of tricky for me lately. Like, PTSD and everything. One of the guys from All Time Low might be there. What is I'm that? Fucking all time Big low. Time Therapy Rush? Twice a day now. Where's twice a day? You don't remember the news two weeks ago? Oh, that was, um... No, I don't. Well, I'll see you later. Yeah, totally. Just RSVP by Thursday so we know. Big time what rush. Fucking bitch. Hey. Oh my god, you're out? Yeah, they cleared me last week, but I didn't feel like going to school. You didn't feel like answering your texts either. I thought you were dying. Well, yeah, I was emotionally. I'm always dying emotionally. Yeah, I'm in therapy twice a day. Shit was wild. Twice so a day? Leg? Oh, yeah, so they said the bullet went deep into my thigh and almost hit an artery. But they got it out, right? The surgery went well? I mean, I'm walking as well as it could go. What? I don't know. When they were putting me under, I was so afraid they were gonna, like, violate me or something. They're doctors, Nicole. They're not gonna do that. Okay, well, that's what they said about teachers, parents, they do do and that. police. So who the fuck can we trust anymore? Oh, God. By the way, do you know what that happened That does with happen the cop? to women a lot. they gave the cop paid leave or something. What the fuck? Being a cop has to be the most cathartic job in the world. Really? Think about it. You're some loser with a gun, and your wife does doesn't want to fuck you, so you go out, shoot a teenager, and get a paid trip to Bermuda. That sounds kind of good, actually. You gonna join the academy? Why would I? I'll never be in a situation where my spouse doesn't want to fuck me, because I'm a perfect 10 with a high libido. They give mall cops guns, do they? Guns I don't know. Maybe Hello, in America. Are we staying oh, what the here? fuck? Well, what are you doing here? After our little skirmish at the mall, the county <laughs> reassigned me to patrol this school to pay my debt to the youth. So let's stay in school this time, huh? Uh, uh, yes, sir. Okay, bye, dude. Sure, but one more thing. Oh, no. If either gonna... one of you get in any <laughs> trouble, shoot I will not hesitate to fucking murder you. Have fun in school, you girls. Yeah, sure thing. Why? Why did they send him here? Dude, you didn't even get shot. Calm down. He said Thanks, he was craft gonna occupant. blow my brains out, Nicole. Oh my god, you're such a poser. What the fuck am I supposed to do? We can't all be sociopaths like you, Nicole. You'll get there. So why are you here? Are you gonna skip again or what? <laughs> I wonder what the guy from Wait, skip is again. Right now. Oh, hey, Nicole. You over here too? Oh, great. Yeah, I just like... I couldn't even handle whatever was going on in class and stuff, and I just had to break loose from it all, you know? Like, I don't know, these teachers are just crazy sometimes. That was the longest possible way to say you're also skipping. Oh, no, like, yeah, um... Hey, I like your shirt. Okay. 
It looks kind of deep. Is uh, there like any okay. sort of meaning behind it? Dude, how the fuck should I know? Okay. You picked it out, I thought, you know. I go to the store, it looks nice, I buy it, and not for an it looks artistic like a shirt conversation from with someone dressed Blue like a Notes. bad religion fan. Oh, well, hold up. I'm not really like a bad religion fan. I only like maybe like four of their albums. I'm real happy for you. Yeah, but I mean, it's cool that you know about them. You like a lot of rock? That was the most weekend dad question you could have possibly asked me. What's that mean exactly? What's going on out here? Oh no. Torture. Oh, hey Megan, what's up? I'm just on my way back from the bathroom. Oh yeah, cool. I like your shirt, by the way. Oh, thanks. Yeah, no, it's like mega fucking cool. Wait, he tells there, like, everybody a, that. Like a story? Actually, there kind of is. It's, um... And that to everybody. Well, I don't want to waste your time. No, no, I, I got time. I'm hanging out. Dumb fucking bitch. So it was custom made, and it was basically a whole story on my journey with, like, finding myself. <laughs> they should make a game show where a guy eats everything in a vending machine. Aww. And if he loses, he's got to, like... Take his shirt off at the pool or something. I'm so dead. Then there's a bunch of hot girls in the pool laughing at his imperfections. I can't. What do I do? Okay, Ari, what is it? Wait, what? I didn't- Bitch, do not play this game with me. <gasps> what game? I was just sitting here talking- Shut the fuck up. What is it? Okay, well, I'm supposed to be in physics right now, Bitch. but there's this project due, and I have literally nothing. Yeah, oh. so- Well, you Wait, should have done your project. Sense. What doesn't? If you cared about the class this much, wouldn't you have done at least some of it? It's not the grade. The teacher's just gonna, like, yell at me in front of everybody. They do it because they care. Not because they're paid shitty and weren't smart enough to work at a university. You think their salary determines how smart they are? Isn't it just a number on paper? They think our grades determine how smart we are. Let's see how the fuck they like it. Okay, but that doesn't solve my problem. I've been oh here my the god, now that I think about it, any there was, excuse. um, there was this, like, Substitute teacher for math I was substituting for a while ago because the math teacher got pregnant every year I'm pretty sure she like timed her pregnancy so that she would have the summer break off and Then just be actively pregnant for the school years and then the substitute teacher anyway She was like, okay, everybody. This is a project. You have to use this concept to make this project and then I realized that is just because it is a huge waste of time for everybody they didn't have to teach, they just gave you project time, which meant that you could do fuck all for the entire class, and they didn't have to do anything. Is it like a two-day project or a three-week project? Closer to three weeks. Huh, what's a problem that lasts more than three weeks? Could you pass for pregnant? I hope not. What works for me usually is saying I have depression, but you can't use that. Why not? Because I use that. If too many kids start saying it, it won't work anymore. All right, I'm just gonna go to class and get yelled at. This sucks. Yeah, or just you say you're pregnant. Live in a methadone clinic. How would I pitch a game show to Spike TV? You there, hold it. <gasps> Here we go. Uh oh. Wait. Oh, how could you run this fast? What was that? Don't make me call security. Hey, you dropped something. Whoa, that is a shit ton of cocaine. I wonder if it's real. You just wait till I call your parents. Shit, she's coming back. Nicole? Hey, Miss Lynn. Rough day at work? What What's is that? going on with Braxton? None of your business. Why aren't you in class? Oh, uh, I was just on my way to the bathroom. You came all the way out to the main foyer on the way to the bathroom? What, do we need bathroom GPS now? Tell me what class you're in right now. Civics? It's okay, I'm going now. Don't worry. I'll walk with you. No, that's oh, okay. No. You don't have to. No. I insist. No. Wow, you can ask me out after. On a date? Why would I do that? Wait, you're not a guy teacher. Sorry, let's go. And as I hope you remembered, today is the final MS day 13? for submitting your community that? service sponsor. If you don't get those hours oh, I in, thanked my community you hours, cannot guys. graduate. Oh my god. Nicole, so nice of you to join us. I tell you to kill yourself in your garage, but you probably only have a two-bedroom condo with your pets. <laughs> I'll pretend I didn't hear that. <laughs> I trust the rest of you will be taking the community service hours seriously. I guess. You guess? Kelly, who's your sponsor? I'm volunteering for the county police department. Wow, that's lame. Something you'd like to add, Nicole? Yeah, why would you help the people who screw us over with speeding tickets? The office is really close to my house. I don't have to drive or anything. So you're gonna fuck the rest of us over just so you can save on gas money? What did I say about the F word in this class? Sorry, bitch. Are we just supposed to drive as fast as we want? The police are here to keep us safe. Is that why I think it's $200? They're keeping my safe, holy shit. Huh. Funny that a girl so critical of our legal system is failing civics. civics. 
funny how you teach the that. most expensive car you could ever afford. <laughs> All right, Nicole. If you're so in tune with the needs of the people, how about your cause? My what? Your cause? It's your a sponsor Honda? for the community service hours? You had two weeks to set something up. Now tell me with who? Depression as an excuse. About that. See, um... I've sort of been going through a lot right it's now. It's like social of studies. Course. Oh, let's hear it. Let's hear another marvelous excuse from Nicole. I've been diagnosed with clinical depression, so I haven't really gotten out of bed much lately. Depression? Yeah, it's from all the PTSD and some other letters. It's that bad? You couldn't at least think of a community service sponsor? Well, I tried a couple times, but when I did, I just got I just shot. Yeah, cutting myself. <gasps> Why? Um, because I'm a burden on everyone around me, and the community would be better off if I was dead. <gasps> oh, jeez. That's really not good. Oh no, a am I bringing the mood down? Sorry. If anyone has a gun, <sighs> I could borrow. I could just take care of myself now. A gun? <laughs> shit! I left mine at home today. Oh my god. Oh shit. You need someone to talk to? No, I don't want to bother anybody. Unless it's for a gun I can use to blow my world. Hunter seems kind of cool. Oh, oh, no. oh my god! Okay, Nicole, this is not for the classroom. I think you need to go to the counselor's office. But don't I need a community service sponsor? We can worry about that later. Just go to the counselor. <gasps> okay. And you're sure you don't want me to kill myself? Because I will if you want me to. I mean, Hunter's kind of... Right he, he seems the my most normal. My nose bleed like the chocolate river from Willy Wonka. <gasps> no, please don't kill yourself. Right, Mr. Cat? Well... What the fuck? No, no, we don't want you to kill yourself. Just go. How's? <laughs> oh, Nicole, come in. Your civics teacher told me you'd be visiting. Have a seat. Sure, but I thought these were one-on-one -on -one sessions. What's she doing here? Normally they are. However, I thought I'd try something oh. different given your both she here for the, the same, same excuse? reason. What reason? Depression. You bitch! Nicole, I understand you're going through a lot right now, but that's that no excuse bitch. for lashing out at that's Ari. That's my excuse. Sorry, it won't happen again. Not like she did anything to deserve it, right? Ari, using an I statement, please tell Nicole how that made you feel this will be good um i feel like you might not be considering my own situation too that's very good thank you now nicole please respond using your own i feel statement go ahead ari i feel you're a conniving fucking bitch how's that this is going to be a long session nicole wait what need another excuse to steal no well, no, it's just... What if I wasn't making it up? What? Making what up? At first, I went to class thinking I'd lie about the depression, but after talking to the counselor, I'm starting to realize there's something I actually am depressed about. Okay, cool. Talk to him about it. I can't. All right, fine. Fuck off then. Bye. <laughs> Wait. What is it? It's something about me. Something I really can't let him know or he'll tell me. Is she parents. pregnant? What are you, gay? What? How did you know? I've never told anyone that. Dude, look at your hair dye. You're either gay or colorblind. But are you okay with that? I mean, what? I wouldn't use that color, oh. but do what you want. Not that. I meant the other thing. Are we in Nebraska now? No one cares if you're gay anymore. Are you sure? This is the most 80s conversation I've ever had. But my cousin in West Virginia is gay. He says it's horrible. It's West Virginia. What the fuck isn't horrible there? Okay. Oh. So around here, you really think no one will care if I'm gay? Maybe like a weirdo or two, but everybody's going to be like, look at that asshole. We're in a white ass high school 10 minutes from the Capitol. This is such a non-issue now. But gay marriage isn't legal here. <gasps> Were you looking to get married? I don't know if I'd ever want to get married. So why do you care? And by the time you do, it'll probably be legal anyway. Why is she telling me? I'm not even friends with her. Government. Ari, you're white. You could be triple gay and the government's still gonna worry about you. You really think so? Oh, hey, Nicole, you still hanging around out here? Did I tell you that's a cool shirt, by the way? Look, hey, Chris, Why does he only talk about shirts? About Ari? Oh my god, don't! Ari's gay. She's gay? Yeah, like lesbian gay. Oh, that's cool. Is, is there like another part to the story or? Go down to the cafeteria, you'll find it there. Oh, it's like a mystery. That's pretty cool. You're so creative inside. All this time I thought this would be the end of my life. 
If you lived in Texas, it would be, but this is civilization, dude. Well, I'll see you around somewhere. And thanks a lot, Nicole. I feel kind of. Nicole's a LGBTQ plus ally. Fuck bitch, you still stole my excuse. Now I have to think of a new one. You didn't start depression, Nicole. I never said that, but I started using depression as an excuse at that school. No one was doing that before me, and now that she took it, everybody's gonna water it down. Do you feel like you're getting to a point where the excuses for not doing homework are more effort than the homework itself? I didn't know you could use know. depression as an excuse. That's another mental disorder I could pull off. Quite a few. Yeah, but whatever I pick, I'll need to research at least a little, right? No, you don't. Mental illnesses are like horoscopes. You just look up symptoms that loosely fit your personality. Holy shit, where's my laptop? Oh, wait! Schizophrenia, good choice. No, I forgot to tell you what happened after the counselor. Ari came out of the closet to me in the middle of the hallway. It didn't she work! The door. I thought everyone knew that. Yeah, that's what I said. She thought it was like this huge deal. Well, wouldn't it be? What if someone homophobic knew? Yeah, who? I don't know anyone at our school who wouldn't vote for Obama. Obama? Holy shit, I can't think of anyone either. This area is like so Democrat, you're just preaching to the choir. Obama! Yeah, last year, this gay guy sat at our table and was immediately the most popular person there. Because he was gay, or...? I mean, kinda. He quoted Amanda's show a lot, I guess he was funny. And no one gave that him shit familiar. or anything. I mean, Kyler came up to us, but everyone was like, what's his problem? That's exactly what I told her. Well, as long as she's happy, like, whatever, right? Amanda I'm show? so happy for her. So happy I have to see her ass every week with the counselor now. And I wanted to say, Ari, how proud I am that you've been able to come to terms with she's your wearing sexual a gay shirt orientation now. and openly share it with the rest of your peers. Thanks, it's just kind of liberating to tell someone I'm gay, you know? Every chance you get. Truthfully, you are so brave. Liberal high school, let's not get ahead of ourselves. Everyone's been so supportive. I can't believe there was a time when being gay was so yeah. hated. You believed it last week. Yes, yes. yes. Times have certainly changed. Yeah. Isn't this supposed to be a group therapy? Is there something you'd like to add, Nicole? Just thought it'd be worth the time to spotlight the progress we've made as a society. Where's the mall cop? Wait, what about the cocaine? a long way to go in terms of sexual identity and acceptance. What's left to accept? Transsexuals, for one. But also the rather silly notion of controlling other petty qualities of our partners beyond gender. Financial background, race, religion, and even age. Oh no! Age? He Why would someone this have a is the weird pedophile counselor. Legal? Isn't that the problem? Letting legality control love. He like the state law the says you can't pedo. marry another girl. But does that mean it's wrong for you to love her? No, but I'm pretty sure age is one we, you know. Society creates laws. But lost in oh, create God. society. He's he's the he's the marathon of you girls pedo. Realize we should never be critical of anyone's preference, regardless of what your parents or TV says. Like gender, age is just another thing on your driver's license. Um, how do you feel about that, Nicole? Do you have an I feel statement? I feel like he wants to fuck children. Yeah, <laughs> that's not true, right, counselor? Like you wouldn't date a fifteen year old, right? Would you date a 15 year old? Maybe, what? but I'm you can't just flip it. So it's not illegal? I just said, going by legality means oh you'd be God. in the wrong too. Did you say in the wrong too? As in you would date a 15 year old? I never said that. I'm merely open minded enough Dude, to. Dude, this not is the guy. The this is literally the guy that we talked about that day when I was like, I think it's weird when a 25 year old dates a 17 year old fresh out of high school. And then he's like, well, it's not technically illegal. And then they like try to debate Lord you. Value of anyone of any age. You're trying to sell a teenage girl on pedophilia using her own gayness as leverage. What the this fuck is, is wrong him? with you? Oh my god. Fuck your therapy. Tennis pedophile love 15 looking bitch. What's a Let tennis go, pedophile? She's just having a personal moment and needs her space. Uh, okay. By the way, I didn't want to make Nicole jealous, but your hair looks absolutely beautiful today. Actually, I'm gonna go check on her to make sure she doesn't, uh, kill herself. Nicole, wait. Wasn't walking. That wasn't like a normal thing, was it? No, him campaigning for that is a pretty normal thing around here. You didn't know? Not that. I meant you sticking up for someone like that. Oh. I never really seen you do that. Sticking up for who? Me. Okay. 
I, okay. I really appreciate it. Uh huh. This is. Um. Okay. Oh my god, this is so fucking stupid. Kinda is. Nicole, I've um. Since we started doing this group counseling together, I've actually kind of been thinking a lot about you. But okay. in a weird way, right? No, it's it's in a weird way. Oh my god. I really, really like you. I'm sorry. It's just you were the first person I came out to, and what you said in there, and your whole look, and I think I'm in love with I, you. In love with someone you know for two weeks. Yeah, I don't even know her. School. You're not like all sketched out now, are you? A little, but it's not like you're a man saying this. How is it different with a man? Men kind of have a tendency to rape and murder. I'm not sure if you've seen a TV in the last forever. Oh god, that reminds me. I never even asked you. Ask me why. You, um, do you like girls too? <laughs> Wait. <laughs> Try lesbianism before college or make a gay girl cry. Try lesbianism before college. Do you want me to? Y yeah. How badly? Extremely. No pressure, but I might cut if you say no. Where do you cut? On my upper thigh, so my parents don't see. Damn, it's actually kind of hot. It, it is? Yeah, because you look too normal to cut, so it's like a fun surprise. Are you messing with me? No, seriously, it's like a cheerleader with a nipple piercing. Ooh, wild side. What? Really? Do you cut too? Duh, but it's not hot when I do it. It's like, look at that trashy hoe. I bet she cuts herself. I don't think you're trashy. I don't think I should have an F in gym. Shit happens, though. <gasps> So, if you think I am hot, would you want to start dating? Uh, yeah, I guess I'll is this try how you, it. This is how you date in high school? It'd be really funny if I said no right now. Please don't do that to me. No, okay, I'll do it. You have a car to take us out? Yeah, my mom's old Camry, and only three of the windows are broken. Does it have power seats? No, they're just manual. What's a power oh, seat? But I could borrow my dad's Lexus if it makes a difference. Ooh. It makes a difference. Okay, I'll see you after school. I love you. Bye. What? Oh yeah, high school. Why'd you take me to a bookstore? It's like the library, but all the books are new. Do I look like a bitch who reads? <laughs> Not even Harry Potter? It's like coming of age relatable and stuff. There's no Percocet in Harry Potter. How's it relatable? No Percocet hey, Nicole, in Harry Potter. Didn't know oh, you no. read here till. We had to stop in the graphic novel section. Do you know him? Not really, but I'll take care of it. So are you reading some manga with your friend there? Oh, she's not my friend. She's my girlfriend. Girlfriend? But you're, hold on. Do you have a problem with two lesbians going to a bookstore as opposed to literally anything else? Though it's good to be yourself. You guys are just a little different, like me. We are nothing like Hold you. It. And why is that? Because while you're beating off to your little anime book, we're gonna get fucked up on whippets and make out. Hey, that what's, was what's completely whippets? uncalled for. Whoa, don't freak out when someone makes up a joke about you. It'll make people think it's real. But I have done that to my manga. She shouldn't act like it's wrong, though. Oh, God. Shouldn't have helped him. I've seen him around before. I didn't know he was fucked up Nitrous like that. Gas. By the way, oh. I started a YouTube channel. Y you guys want to see it? No, we gotta go by We're whippets. the VAs. They, whippets. There's a Genshin VAs in this. And then the counselor got so weird, he called my mom. The and Target my dog shirt. If I ever mentioned he was a pedophile. And what'd your mom say? She believed him. We had like an hour long fight over it. Right, honey? Right, honey? Dude, I said don't call me that in public. Oh, I thought it was don't say it in private. If I didn't want it in private, why would I want it in public? I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I'm still getting used to your boundaries and everything. Boundaries? I didn't know you're dating a marriage counselor. What's up, queers? Nicole. Dude, she's not gonna do anything. Heard you guys were dating now. What are you, special or something? Why do you care? Tired of hoes like you always looking for attention. Find one other person in this room who cares. No one's falling for this bullshit like you think. What they did are. we do? Hey, Hunter, what's up? They're saying they're gay now. That's fucking dumb, right? Uh, Obama might be president soon. Who's worried about being gay anymore? Dude, fuck Obama. He's a bitch. My dad's voting for McCain. Why would he vote for McCain? He's a fucking war hero. Maybe then we'll nut up and nuke the Middle East. Oh. Well, sorry, dude, but your dad sounds really fucking gay voting for McCain. Oh, what? that. No, no, you're gay. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for taking care of that, Nicole. No That's problem. pretty on hey, par you for. the longest pizza line and get me four slices? Oh, yeah, nine. Sure, anything. Okay. Why aren't you going? 
You won't kiss me on the cheek first? Oh my god. Mwah. Okay, I'll be right back. Ugh, disgusting. What, are you straight again? No, I have dollar store foundation on my lips now. Ugh, this could double as baby formula in Pakistan. She's your girlfriend. So? So take your bitch to Ulta. No, already trying to limit oh, the exposure. Oh, buy her Ulta. Thanks, Ethiopia. You haven't even dated for a week yet. Fucked up, right? Did she do something wrong? She just gets really awkward when you're around her for long enough. Awkward how? Okay, so she was in my room while I was changing real quick. Then she saw one nipple for like a second and was all, Oh my god, I'm sorry I look, but you're so sexy, you're so sexy, I'm so lucky to have you. Like, bitch, fuck off. I've seen her with guys before, I don't know why she's acting like such a virgin. She's probably just a virgin with girls, it's like a higher echelon. But if she's so gay, why was she even with guys in the first place? Cause hooking up with a guy is the easiest thing on earth. Even if a girl's gay, she's gonna try it at least once or Why are we times. so mean about Wait, our gay so girlfriend? First time you're curious, second time you're bored, and ninth time you're just trying to keep the lights on. And I just want to see how cool it is that you guys are so open about this. Right? Yeah. I kissed a girl at a party once, and I totally get the appeal. Lesbianism is just so, so bold. Have you thought about, like, going full time with it? You mean, like, gay married? Yeah. Fuck that. Then I wouldn't have a rich husband. Isn't there more to a relationship than money, though? Maybe? Full time lesbianism right as opposed Camry, to part time? It's cute, but I'd never cuff a broke bitch. Can you believe her? Yeah, these by curious hoes, fuck them. By the way, did you wanna- Hold on, I'm replying to something. Okay. Are you done? No, shut up, hold on. Nicole, I, I don't really like it when you tell me to shut Just up. Just fuck up, okay? Maybe quit the box die, it's fucking your brain up. <gasps> oh, shit. I, um... Hey, listen, uh... I'm really sorry for not respecting your boundaries. I promise it won't happen again. Oh. What? I was totally in uh, the wrong. You had every right to say oh. that. Well, as long as you're sorry, you dumb bitch. I know I'm a dumb bitch. I'm sorry. I love you. I think I'm starting to love you too. Uh oh. You guys see the new Smallville? <laughs> Dude, Smallville's for straight people. Who watches that shit? You were straight three weeks ago. Yeah, and I didn't watch it then either. Guess it's just universally bad. So are we bad. like just super so gay now? Episodes once. It was okay. Was anyone asking you? Um, oh no. Just checking. Anyway, I was gonna buy lunch today, but the lines We're are so like mean so to her now. Long. It's probably spicy chicken sandwich day. Like Toxic lesbianism. Ari, right, get us the chicken sandwiches. I'll pay you back. But the line's gonna take forever. Can we just. Don't you love me? <sighs> okay, I'll go. Cool. Yeah, and get me two if they have enough. They're big. You gonna eat two? One for now, one for when I'm depressed. All right, you got all that? Be right back. You're forgetting something. Oh, right. Sorry. Mwah. Good girl. Don't make me ask again. I know. Using I love her you. lesbian That's powers nice. for evil, yeah. What the fuck? I know. What's her problem, right? No, what the fuck did you do to her? She's like your pet now. Yeah, so you know how I wanted out of the relationship? What I thought would be more fun than breaking up was just seeing what I could get away with. Get away with what? Dude, like everything so far. I'll literally call her a bitch to her face and she'll just apologize and kiss me what? on the cheek. It's such a power trip. Are we the bad uh, guys? It sounds like a beast. I don't want to do that. that. But honestly, if it is, abusing feels fucking awesome. <gasps> don't knock it till you try it. Yeah, but you know why you're I getting away get with it, right? Oh, let's hear this. Because you're her only option. So you're taking advantage of the fact the only lesbian in school knows there aren't any other lesbians to date here. I mean, she's Nicole's just evil. She's with whatever you want to put her through. She can break Thanks up anytime she wants. Rat. She's not stuck with anything. Okay, so she breaks up to move on to who? The only girl willing to date her is her abusive ex-girlfriend. And? No offense, but you're like an evil fucking bitch. Bitch, no, I know okay. I am, If bitch. you're so high and mighty about it, why don't you tell her everything yeah, you just bitch. told me? The dynamic, the game, everything. I don't know her like that. Awkward, ew. If only <laughs> life was like Awkward. TV, where friends spill their hearts out to people they barely know. That's you true. You probably don't even watch anything good. You watch Smallville. You're evil. You're friends with someone who's evil. You're friends with someone who watches Smallville. Holy shit, don't say it that loud. What's Smallville? Again, I oh no. Apologize for the misunderstanding we had last He's time retro and elegant trooper. I would never want to be mistaken for an abuser. I can assure you that. Uh-huh. Abuser? Yes, anyway. Nicole, it's been a while since we've chatted. What's going on with you? What's going on with me? Yes, if you'd care to share with us. What the hell do I say to that? 
A variety of things. You could speak about what you did over the weekend or Why are we still having this counseling lately. together? Ari and I are here to listen. Okay, well, I heard Kanye West just got out of jail. Really? Wait. Tell me more. <laughs> really? Um, he was in jail and then he wasn't in jail. So why was he in jail in the first place? He broke somebody's camera and now his new Wait! album's delayed. Or was that when he was with Kim Kardashian? And he like smacked somebody? Wait, Kanye West break camera. Oh, he got physical with... Wait, this is 2023. Wait, video. September 11... September 11? 2008. Wait. Oh. Interesting. Wait, there was, um, Kanye West walks into stop sign. Alright, Gary, what's going on with Kanye and Kim? Now, Kanye, baby, he's rushing away and just getting away and they ran to a damn pole. Whoa! Oh, Kanye! Oh, they didn't even catch. Kanye, you okay? <laughs> they didn't even That's all I remember. This is 10 years ago. Wow. Something. A new album. Do you think it'll be as good as his last album? No. Why are you pretending like you know what I'm talking about? I'm not pretending. Just having a conversation. Uh, name one Kanye West song. Um, I can't think of any off the top of my head. I actually can't even think of any what either. What are some of your favorites? Dude, you're so fucking gay. Nicole, you know that word isn't welcome on this campus. I'm gay now, I can say it. The F word. But the homophobic one's fine then. Well, out of respect to Ari here, I wouldn't say that's fine either. <laughs> Ari, how Thanks, does that Junior. make you feel? Well, I've actually, never heard Gold Digger. I actually wanted to ask something. When you said we mistook you for an abuser, <gasps> she's yes, getting out. Go on. Like how? You you weren't violent or anything. I don't get it. Abuse can come in many. I probably forms. have, but I probably Not have, but I don't violence, know it, so it doesn't physical count. Physical assault. It could be psychological, emotional, financial, anything that asserts control over another person. Like how you want to molest kids? I think they call it sexual abuse. Nicole, what did I say? What? Something about fucking kids? That's it. This session is over. I'm sorry, but you'll both have to come back at a later time he does. when you learn how to behave yourselves. But I didn't... Out. But oh, he does. Fuck. He does. He's like the guy in every sitcom's pedophile episode. Every sitcom has a pedophile episode? Yeah, where the kids learn a lesson or whatever. Oh, yeah. Nicole? What? Could I ask you something? No, sorry. I don't have any more kisses today. The kiss factory's closed. Somebody died. No, it wasn't about that. It was... Uh... Why are you dating me? Why am I dating you? Why am I doing anything? I don't know. It's just... I was thinking about what the counselor said in there. Dude, your shirt doesn't see through. He's just a pervert. Well, no, that's a way bigger problem, but... I'm just talking about us We right should break now. up with her. What about us? I'm just thinking, like, what we've been it's for been the last three couple weeks. weeks. You mean awesome? Maybe awesome for you, which is good, but what he said about how abuse works, it, it kind of made me worried. So I'm abusing you? Uh, I don't know. If you do, I don't think you mean to. When have I ever hit you or anything? You haven't, but the emotional yes. abuse <gasps> and Thanks, how don't it move controls. Dog. You're really putting weight into what the fuck he says? He's a counselor. Are we gaslighting he her now? Stuff. I'm your girlfriend. I pay for your five guys. He wants to put his dick in a child. How am I getting outclassed here? No, I always have to pay when we go to five guys. Okay, well, your dad drives a Lexus. Don't worry about it. Oh. But I'm just saying, like, how are you going to let our freak fucking counselor put all oh. these ideas in your head? Nicole, I've had these ideas for a while. I've, I want to try five give guys. Me the words to tell you. Tell me what? I don't think we should see each other anymore. So, I'm losing my girlfriend because of the pedophile counselor? I'm sorry, Nicole. I got dumped before the counselor got reported. Well, I'm gonna go home and kill myself. Me when there's a minor inconvenience. Is dust off the same high as whippets? I never tried dust off. 
Really? Is that the compressed air spray for the PC? A guy offers. Why would I flirt with a guy to get a free hit of dust off? You can get the whole thing at a store for like three dollars. Oh. Only three dollars. Don't they make? Yeah, yeah they make it taste like shit staples. so that oh, people don't staples? have it. What are you two high school musical to walk into a Staples now? No, every time I go in the one near school, the manager always flirts with me. He's like, let's find you a new computer, sweetie. What if he this just wants to sell you a new computer? This was before that. Oh. With his hand on my ass. Okay, a little late on that detail. You don't complain when the guy at Paxson does it. Cause the How guy do I know? Because they, I actually they, want. they put a warning on the can and I read it. It was like, uh, do not inhale. It fucking something something tastes like shit or something. I'm not gonna make out with a manager for a free pencil case. Are you saying you made out with a guy at Paxson? You're gay, right? Don't ask, don't tell, bitch. Not gay anymore. Oh my god, I forgot. Sorry, I wasn't thinking. No, it's okay. I'm over Girl, it. stop Are wearing sure? fucking polo Didn't shirts. You, like, Try killing yourself over it? Honestly, not really. Like, I got in the tub, caught a little, and the water What is his dad nice fit? Warm, and, I don't know, I just wasn't feeling it. I get that. Oh shit, she's coming over here. What? Why? Hey, Nicole. Hi? I just wanted to talk a little again, see how you were doing. You haven't showed up to the group depression counseling in a while. <laughs> yeah, I sort of quit that. I figured it would be awkward and everything. You haven't showed the like group this. depression Sorry, counseling. Sorry, I know. I just worry a lot. Uh, are you trying to get back together again? I don't get it. Yeah, uh, that's not exactly an option for me anymore. Hey, Ari, what's going on? Oh, nothing. I was what? just stopping up here. Who's this? Oh, yeah, um, Nicole, this is my boyfriend, Hunter. We've been dating for what? a couple weeks now. Hey. What the fuck? Is something wrong? Oh, uh, I was just thinking about Staples. The store? Long story. Ari, I gotta get back, but your tray is at the table for you. Oh, you're so sweet. Thank you, Snooker. Oh my god, her standards are so low now because because of the abuse. So now she's dating anybody. Flux says Snookums. What was that? Oh, sorry. What I said was, I thought you were gay. Okay, I knew we'd have to talk about this eventually. Are you bisexual now? Honestly, no. What the fuck? Are you thinking about Staples again? No, like what the fuck is going on? Yeah, how can you have a boyfriend if you're not bisexual? The truth is, I still love everything about girls. I love how they talk, how they laugh, how they use moisturizer, how they do makeup. I love how girls do their hair, how they smell nice, how they don't wear the same thing every day. And I really love how they hold your hand and how it feels when they kiss you back. Dating you helped me find the words for that, Nicole. Then you're dating a guy because... Because, like, even though I feel that way, I have to be honest with myself. Girls are kind of high maintenance. Girls play mind games I can't figure out. And so the month we had together made me realize something else. Realize what? I realize that guys turn me off, but girls make me want to fucking kill myself. <laughs> you bullied a gay girl into being straight. Damn! She's straight now, she's just gonna be we miserable. We scared for her, her straight. Are you seriously not getting how bad this is? How bad what is? You bullying a gay girl into being straight? I didn't bully her. I was just abusive while dating her. <laughs> I was just What's abusive. The difference? One's homophobic, the other's just regular bad. So you get how bad this is then. <laughs> Bitch, you watch Smallville. Do you get how bad that is? Is Smallville That's really not that bad? This time, Nicole. What the fuck is this? Why do you even care? Whatever. Should I watch Whatever Smallville? What? Are we not friends anymore? Well, I wouldn't want you as an enemy. Holy shit. No, explain to me how this is any more awful than anything I usually do. Because usually you do it to men. I'm like, was that overboard? And you always say he'll end up a rapist or pedophile anyway. But she's a teenage girl, Nicole. She is a gay, codependent teenage oh, girl. Oh, it's a he it's hero it show? What's your excuse? Hey, this time? where? You know what they're missing? They're missing the I love booby bracelets. That the little, like, depression idea. Soft plastic thingies. You should have said nothing. I love boobies. Do you ever feel guilty for just wondering if you should feel guilty? She poured her heart out again and again over how she felt about me, but it's like, isn't she better off? No silly like, bands. I told her it's hot she cuts herself, and I wasn't lying, but am I really the one here? Going by Jekka's bitch morality, abusing her was a good thing. Figured it out sooner than later, right? But then you gotta ask, 
Would you rather be alone or have a hot, twisted bitch who demeans you in public but gives amazing head? These are the real questions that plague society. I wonder if it's like that for the other physically bisexual, mentally gay girls. Talking with straight guys must be so fucking weird for them. They're both worried about what girls are thinking. Both go into depressive fits when a girl won't text them back. They experience the same dating dynamics, and yet they will never bond over it. Because the guy will say, well, if you're sad and lonely, I'm here. And she'll go, I'm actually more gay than bi. And then he's like, all right, bitch, fuck you then. <laughs> you don't know how it feels. I'm not saying I've seen it, but it's totally possible. Did I have a moral with this? Fuck. What? What about the mall car? Wait, what about the the cocaine we picked up? Oops. Wait, commit charity fraud. Then we don't go to the counselor. I didn't pick it up. I did pick it up. It's a uh, it's like a non-profit. A non-profit what? A non-profit charity. A non-profit charity for what? A cause. You wanted it for a cause, right? What is the cause? A healthy cause, so people are healthy. And how do they make them healthy? Medicine. So, pharmaceuticals. What's the name of this pharmaceutical non-profit? Ooh, gotta get back to you on that one. You signed up for a charity and don't even know the name of it? It was kinda long, I don't have it in front of me. But it was definitely a charity and definitely for medication to the- Bol Yeah, bowling for Columbine? It? Bitch, no one asked you. I was oh. asking. You're aware you'll need to fill out a form with the location of this charity, right? <laughs> Wait, Just so we know it's not made up. Yeah, totally, I'll get all that for you next class. It was due today. Well. I don't know what to tell you. Is the charity going to disappear because I didn't get <laughs> yeah. it on time? If you're fine with your grade uh, taking a 10% hit, then be my guest. My policy on all late work. Dude, you need to stop watching C-SPAN. How did you know what I watch at lunch? You just seem like a rules fan. I hope everyone here is a rules fan. This is civics. If rules did anything, wouldn't rape and murder stop happening? It stops most of it. Okay, let's tell all the rape and murder victims that. I'm sure it'll make them feel better. Get your charity in next class and hope I don't fail you for the year. God failed you for your entire life. <laughs> you can so say that to a like, teacher? I looked at you and I just asked, are you going to buy me alcohol at one in the morning? Exactly. Like, I thought you were supposed to look out for me, Mom. If you don't give me what I want, I'll find someone who will. Dude, totally. We turned 15 and they're entirely clueless to our needs. And getting locked in this bitch eight hours a day means I, I need the edge off. Is 16 mom a bitch now, 17? Or is it just us? Uh, Jekka hates her mom, so I guess everyone. Last game Where was 16. Is Jekka? Probably doing something dumb as shit, like school. Hey guys, what's good? Yeah, they should be 17 now. Hi. Why do you always come up to us at lunch? Will you shut the fuck up and let me talk? <laughs> Bye then. No, no, all right. I just wanted to know if you knew people setting up the county's worship festival next weekend. County's yeah, worship festival? Yeah, they're 17. Is that like Jesus and shit? Do we look like the type of girls who would go to church? No, it's not like super religious. It's just like a county fair. So what do you want to know? Okay, there's this really hot girl on the organizing committee and I need to get on it. So if you know any religious people, just tell them I want to join. Do we look like the type of girls who know girls who go to church? Who's the girl? I can't tell you that. You might try to ruin it. All of this sounds like an excuse to come up and talk to us. Yeah, are you lonely? What? No. All right, whores. Fuck you then. <laughs> I think he was lonely. Like, we would even know people who set church functions. What's up, whores? I barely know people at this school in general anymore. Did your friends transfer? No. I always hook up with my friend's boyfriend, <clears throat> so they don't want to talk anymore. Oh, that's why we get along. You have a cheating thing, too? Uh, no. I've just never liked a guy enough to the point of calling him I have to be really bad. I'll be back. Good. I have to pee.
dude, I think some girls, like, get off on messing with another girl's boyfriend. It's very- they are not girls' girls. That is the- that is one of the most, like, heinous shits that you could do as a girl. That is so fucked up. Uh, yeah, it's a power trip shit. My friend was telling me that one of her friends was, like, talking to another friend's boyfriend a lot. Highness? Heinous? <laughs> Highness? Heinous. Heinous! Like, anus. Yeah, like, it's heinous as fuck. It's heinous. And they would, yeah, they would, like, Snapchat them pictures. Not, like, nudes or anything, but, like, pictures that they wouldn't even send to the girlfriends. Like, so they would show them, like, hey, I just got this cosplay, which, like, you have plausible deniability, but it's still fucking weird. And then you put the girlfriend in a weird situation where if she's like, hey, um, I feel like you're getting a little too close to this other girl, like, could you just dial it back a little bit? And then, you know, if the other girl catches wind of that, she can say, oh, we're just being friendly. Weird. You're like, if you're a girl's girl, you should respect your girlfriend's boundaries. Weird. Yeah, and then she could turn around and be like, oh, you're being paranoid and jealous and like all that shit. That's crazy. They could just be really good friends for sure, but I feel like you gotta communicate, you know? Yeah, is your girlfriend like not chill like me? I'm so chill. I get her I get along with guys like so much better because girls are just so full of drama and I find guys more fun. I'm really chill and cool. Like you should hang out with me more. Your girlfriend's just insecure. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, pick me, pick me, pick pick me, pick me. Pick me. I don't know you're into that. I'm like a charity for guys sick of their girlfriends. Charity. Fuck, I still have to do that. Do what? I made up a fake pharmaceutical charity for civics, and now I gotta either find a real one or just make up better lies for the fake one. Both sound like a lot of effort. No kidding. Or you could start your own charity. And you're not me lying. Girlfriend. That sounds like more work than both options put together. Feel like the BF to blame too? I think so, yeah. I think it's like, it comes down to communication. It comes down to communication for sure. Thanks, Greg, 2D Max. And then I had another friend that um, her boyfriend was away somewhere. He meets a girl uh, traveling somewhere. He comes back. He starts like FaceTiming her in front of the girlfriend. That is weird. Like, and, and the guy just is too stupid to understand that that is inappropriate because sometimes they are just stupid. Sometimes they are just stupid and moronic and of like how that is like kind of inappropriate considering that the girlfriend doesn't even know who that is. Strange. That is very stupid. <clears throat> I booked an appointment in uh, this week to try to get my PS5 fixed. I think it's brick. It's not turning on. And then see how that goes. Hopefully they can fix it. Fuck no. You think people actually work at those charity things? They just vacate in Florida and write it off as a conference. How would you know? My fucking piece of shit dad who I want to kill works for a charity business. <laughs> Is there... Okay, we want to explore that one. No, but that's actually a good You're idea. the queen of yeah. double standards, Jesus Christ? What? Oh, your other... Okay, what, what, what? His other message says it's all because of the white people. I don't know what that means. I don't get it. What? What? Do, wait, what? Did I say something about double standards? No? Oh. They're just dumb? No, he understood it wrong. He's just schizo. Oh, okay. Yeah, I think he's a little confused. He didn't say anything. They're not responding. That guy's account created this year, probably a sock. Yeah, probably. I think I know exactly where they come from. Oh, and did you hear about Braxton? He tried selling a brick in school. No, I had no idea. To who? Probably a teacher with a coke problem. Anyways, guys are pretty stupid. Could afford that. 
where would he even hey if it isn't my favorite gym students thanks Never jerry lily we did it how are we your favorite students oh, i know what you're doing you want to stay looking nice for your favorite gym teacher why would we care about that i hear how you girls talk about older men and quite frankly i support it you want to say that in front of the principal yeah and it's older men not ancient men yeah we'll see about that when you're looking for an expensive good time <laughs> How many times this month what is he trying to out? Three. But yeah, where would Braxton even get a brick of coke? I think his friend's cousin's in MS-13. Oh, shit. Wait. What's wrong? We didn't get to do anything with the coke no earlier. Deal. Everyone's a little dry from PG County. You going to class? Nah, Wait, going he home. had the it's pack of... Was it him that dropped enough. the pack of coke? Maybe it was him. Okay, so I need a charity, a way to ditch this badass brick, and money in general. Let's see. I can't just sell the coke. Wait, I have it. For me. Oh, I have it right now. Two birds with one stone. God, this shit feels so good on my gums, too. I try it for real, but I don't know if it'd mix well with my mom's Vicodin. How is this a prescription med? It feels as good as the street drug. I got it. Where's my laptop? How would I word this? How to freebase. What the fuck is freebasing? Am I supposed to? I'm feeling lucky. Oh, I can't. Now I'm told if you didn't get your community service causes in last time, you better have them today. Oh. Turning coke into Excuse crack? Me. Hey, oh, where's Mr. Katz? What? Today I'm filling in for Mr. Katz as he had a medical issue he needed to take care of. So I had another two days to think of a charity? God damn it. You think because I'm subbing today, I won't enforce your teacher's deadlines? Don't forget, I'm your principal. Oh my. And speaking of deadlines, Mr. Katz took extra care to remind me of your assignment in particular, Ooh. Nicole. It's your last day to submit or Turning you failed this class for the year. So what do you have for me? Uh, I have my charity. <gasps> what charity might that be? I was told it had to do with pharmaceuticals, so let's not stray too far from any. Dude, streamers do coke at the parties yeah, all the whatever. time. The name of my maybe I should ask them what freebasing is. I'll be like, yo, can you show me how to freebase that cocaine? <laughs> Medicine rocks. Medicine rocks. Yeah, it's a charity that helps get prescription drugs to the underprivileged in PG County. Why haven't I heard of this charity? I don't know. PG County's far. Not that far. Well, they're really underfunded, so they can't get the word out. Wanted to volunteer for something that could actually use free basing some help. is for poor people. Oh, I guess they don't free base then. Oh, what's that supposed to mean, bitch? You know what the fuck it means. <laughs> girls, girls. Uh, I'll have to look them up sometime then. They'd have a website, wouldn't they? No, they don't really have anything on the internet because they're underfunded and underprivileged. Not everyone has the technology us well-funded whites do, Miss Lynn. <laughs> what do you mean by that? If you Google them, you're racist. She got you there. Hush! Well, I have to say I'm pleasantly surprised with you, Nicole. Here's your hour sheet. You'll need 25 hours in the next six weeks. With signatures. Yeah, okay. We operate under the honor system. But don't think I won't keep my eye on you. Oh, I'm wet. What was that? Nothing. Hey, let's see you fail one of these other losers. Anyone else have a charity for me? Dude, no. I've been looking everywhere for you. Since when do you take elective gym? It's the easiest class ever. You just be skinny and get an A. And get sexually harassed by the gym coach. No, he doesn't do that for the seniors. He thinks we're old enough to tell our parents or something. Ew, I wouldn't tell my parents at any age. I don't yeah, think that's, that's like the reason why. Embarrassing. Imagine telling your mom a 50-year-old man wants to eat a Lunchable out of your cleavage. Exactly. Parents and sex are two entirely different worlds. Unless you're in Arkansas. The only way I tell is for a pity dinner at Red Lobster. Hi, bar. So what do you want? Oh, yeah. I have I've a never had Red Lobster. With. Nicole, that MySpace girl isn't even fun to bully anymore. No, not that. Another project. Project for what? For school. Since when the fuck do you do any project for school? Since I got a really awesome idea for it, but I need you to bring some stuff over She's to my house. She's freebasing the cocaine. <sighs> okay, what is it? I need baking soda, a Zippo lighter, some really tiny Ziplocs, and one of your parents' serving spoons. Are you in chemistry now? No, civics. Where the hell am I gonna get really tiny Ziplocs? Is your mom in a jewelry? She would have those lying around. Okay, so Ziplocs, serving spoon, lighter, what else? Baking soda, a whole box of it. Baking soda. Okay, I'll see you after school. <laughs> Thanks, I'll explain later. She's making How long is it gonna take to crack. Hey, right, sweet cheeks, you got a minute? Miss Lynn said you're oh, not he's allowed sniffing. to sniffing because he, he lost his coke. Hey, quick question for you. What? Are you familiar with Lunchables chicken shakeups? Oh God. 
thanks for coming. I know it was super short notice. Yeah, so what do you need all this shit for? Okay, don't I freak have out. never in my life Oh shit, the crack you found scene. It? I've I, I was just gonna I've never in my life seen a t-shirt jacket leather. T-shirt leather jacket. Anyways, yours or something? Sorry. No, there's a rumor going around that some gang kid lost a huge thing of coke at our school. That Braxton kid just ditched it in front of me while running from school security. And you didn't think, oh, that's oh, a lot of illegal years. drugs. Maybe more trouble than they're worth. Since when are we afraid Thanks, of the law? Jonah I'm not talking about the law. I'm talking about MS-13's name on the side of the fucking bag. They're gonna kill you if they but find out. But just scribble it out. Hey, you know who MS-13 is. One of my friend's cousins was an MS-13. I guess everyone's friend's cousins oh, is MS-13. Oh, it's Dana? No way oh, it's MS-13. It was... Why would a gang put their name on their drugs what if it was supposed to be delivered to them what shitty ass drug dealer would keep their customers names in writing a really fucking stupid one isn't stupid enough to bring this to a public school right, packaging, it. Yeah. Wait, we it drop ship it drop ship the cocaine we just stole finished with what you brought the package right yeah for you brought me here to cook crack? Yeah! What else is baking soda for? I don't know, baking? Dude, why are you freaking out? We've had drugs before. Yeah, perks and robo, not go to jail drugs. Okay, just let me borrow your stuff. I need the community service hours. What does making crack do for the community? Nothing. Selling crack's another story. We live in cul-de-sacs. Who's gonna buy this? I'm not selling I don't know. Here. Some people oh probably would. This is gonna ruin my parents' serving <laughs> spoon. Just buy another one. Add it some vitamin D so it's healthy. Stop! Spoon to make crack. You never told me what it was for. Look, no. So it'll take like an hour at most. We're gonna repackage our crack. I think we're getting the hang of this. We filled so many baggies. But how do we know if it's good? The guy on the internet said if you break one of the little shards, it should give a really nice snap. That was bad. Try another one. Oh, it worked. So it's oh good wow. God, my gums are still numb from rubbing this shit. It's good, right? Oh my god, yeah. I want to try Coke for real, but I feel like I kill someone on it. Oh. I just don't want to OD, but good to know your potential. All right, the whole room smells like burnt plastic. So Wait. My parents are going <laughs> to be I so pause mad this? I see this spoon. Just leave it here. It's better lost There's... than ruined. That's true. Okay, I got to go to PG County now. Can you give me a ride? I'm not driving to PG County, Nicole. What if my car gets stolen? Oh, so you'll freebase crack but won't drive through a black neighborhood? What are you, Ronald Reagan? I helped you with your community service project. You won't guilt me into anything. Okay, just drive me to the Franconia station. I'll take the metro. Fine, but I'm not driving you back. No problem. I'll have plenty for a cab when I'm done. Do teenagers really do this? Should have looked up how to okay, there was this video I saw that was like when you buy the cookies and then it was like this guy, a SpongeBob, buying a burger and then it starts blaring on the PA. It's like broke guy alert. <laughs> broke guy alert. Did you know what I'm talking about? <laughs> oh, they... <clears throat> I thought that was a funny meme. That that's all. Before I came out. Broke guy. I can't. Okay, I can't say it. Hey, what's up? Hey, what you got? Chat. You wanna buy Post some crack? What? Oh, they thought I was a cop. Damn, I did sound like a cop, huh? Oh, fuck. 12! Hey, Mo. What you need? What you got? I got rocks, bricks, white Legos. Uh, uh, how much? 100 for the baggie. Uh, uh, here you go. Thanks. Oh, one more thing. What? Could you sign my community service hours sheet? I'll give Wait. you an extra rock. <laughs> Yeah, okay. Wait, this is community service hours, right? Yeah, just any fake name, it's fine. I pee. Hundred bucks and a two-hour signature. I think this is gonna work out. <gasps> cool. Uh oh. Now that I've called roll, I just wanted to apologize for my absence. I know you've all been working very hard on your community service assignment. Has everything Can been okay? Can you Not to get too far into detail, but I've been having some personal health issues arise and What's have made a time away from my teaching duties. Oh, well, we hope you're all right. I don't give a shit. Here. Oh, is attendance over? Sorry. So nice of you to what join us. What is that shirt? Later, as always. Fuck you, you've been gone the last three classes. <laughs> he had a medical issue. Yeah, I do too. It's called liking post-rock. No one rolls out the red carpet for me. Just have a seat, Nicole. You can have this dick, bitch. <laughs> Dude, why are you freaking out? All right, Nicole, you act like you own the place, so I assume you're a top of the class in community hours? I might be. Pull oh, out your bake. sheet then. Let's see what our star student has for us. 
Yeah, sure, here you go. Of course, as I expected, you... <gasps> Wait, how many is this? I don't know, I lost count. 16, 18, 22 hours? Wow. I only have three. All the signatures are different, different ink used every time. It's only been a week and a half and you're 90% done. <gasps> I'm kind of awesome like that. I'm shockingly surprised, Wait, Nicole. Just, it's so Good easy to see to you fake. really took the initiative for getting these hours. And aside from just the hours, I'm really building a reputation in the community. Anytime someone's in need, they know who to call. Quite the turnaround indeed. All right, who else has their sheets to show? Nah. What yeah, people mean, carry nah? pens. Why not? In their car? Okay. <laughs> Excuse me? What does helping the community have to do with one's sexuality? Uh, it has to do with it's gay. <laughs> you think that way now, but go above <clears throat> and beyond for this. Get 50 hours. You'll get a framed certificate from the National Honor Society. Why would anyone want that? It means you really made a difference in life. For years, you can hold on to it, show it to your grandkids one day. Who I do not that? approve. Yeah, imagine you're 80 and you haven't accomplished anything beyond a community service. Dude, I I, when I was a kid, I was in a kid in this era, all right? I was literally this year, 09, I'm pretty sure I was eight years old. My sister was 10 years old. We had that conversation about Shrek. She was like, I was like, I don't remember. What was it? What what did what was it? Something something about my something about my sister asked me what I was scared of and I said nothing scares me more than myself. And then my sister said, "Well, that's gay." All right, all right. Who else has a sheet for me? Nicole, I'm busy. Well, what is it? Oh, good, so I can leave? No, why were you sent here? One of the security people eight. said I was violating the dress code. Well, it looks like there's a gun on your sweatshirt, so yes, take it off. I, I don't really have anything under this. Then turn it inside out and get back to class. Ew, how do I turn a hoodie inside out? It's gonna be weird and itchy. You really don't have anything on under that? Like a sport bra? Well, we can't just have you in that. Are you sure? I think your gym teacher would love it. <laughs> Please, Nicole, I'm dealing with enough as it is right now. What's the big deal over a drawing of a gun on my hoodie? Have you already forgotten Virginia Tech? Oh, so some Asian guy shoots up a school and now we can't wear What's cool Virginia hoodies anymore? What's Virginia Tech? It could promote the wrong message. Who's gonna think I would shoot up a school? He was only a mass shooter because he's weird and ugly. I'm kind of the opposite of that. All right, fine. Wear it for the rest of the day, but don't bring it to school again. Whatever. School shooting oh, oh, zero eight. one more thing. Oh, I almost forgot. What? I've been told of your quick turnaround in civics. Congratulations on your hours. Yeah, I got shot oh, by yeah, a cop by it. the mall. I... In not, I got shot by a cop in the mall by a mall cop. Also, I remember um, there was a kid that got suspended because he ate his pop tart in the shape of a gun years ago. Night and day difference in no time at all, really. Where'd you find the motivation for it? Uh, I don't know. The community, I guess. Oh, no, no, no. I got shot by a cop, a mall cop in in the mall in the game, not in real life. Not in, I've never been shot in real life. <laughs> Out of my back. In the game. You love the people that much now? Yeah. Look me in the eye and say that. I've never what been shot. What are you, shot. Like, Dom? Is there something you'd like to tell me, Nicole? Can I tell you to fuck off? You're free to go. I'll be watching. <laughs> yeah, right. Here I was thinking oh, hey, Daph was What's a hood. Good. I'm not yeah. hood. Cool, so I, I just wanted to ask if you were busy this weekend. Fucking why? I gotta do a video for a class project and was kind of wondering if you could be in it. Why can't you ask the other 30 people who take the class with you? Yeah, um, it's like, I don't know. I feel like they're gonna flake on me. And a girl who doesn't take the class, doesn't even like you, she's gonna come through. What, you don't like me? I hate you. <laughs> Dude, like, quit like, you're always kidding around and stuff. You're crazy though, it's cool. I'm not laughing. No girl <laughs> randomly laughing. recruited for your class video will ever wanna fuck you. Whoa, whoa, quit jumping around and shit. What's the end game then? You're gonna awkwardly go up to a girl just to be friends? Well, I mean, Friends kind of have a lot of definitions to it. Is there a definition where you blow your brains out with a shotgun while I sit and watch? <laughs> what the fuck? Why would you do that? What else are friends for? 
So, are, are you waiting for somebody? Yeah, and she Wait, was his name always either. Crispin? Bro, you're acting wild. How can you even say something like Bro. that? Hey, sorry, I got held up in math. Jekka, would you fuck Crispin? Ew, no. See, no one wants Ew. to fuck you. You guys are just, man, you guys are wild. Fuck Worst thing leave. she could say is no. <laughs> Ew. Okay, I'll see you around, guys. What the fuck are you talking to him for? Oh my Do god, you are you guys dating me? <laughs> Ew. And he's like, I don't know, I was alone and he came up to me. You know they get brave when we're alone? What was the holdup? I was flirting with my teacher. 39 He's for a business wholesome or boy. pleasure? He's 50, what do you think? I was trying to get an A minus. Cool, yeah, I might finish with an A for the year in civics at the rate I'm going. He bought it? He doesn't have to buy anything, they're real signatures. I'm amazed you haven't been killed yet. Oh my god, if you just keep to yourself, no neighborhood's all that dangerous. You're not keeping to yourself, you're selling crack. Yeah, and PG loves me for it, so there's no reason to kill me. Okay, we'll see. Dude, you're such a hater, you sound like Bitch Lynn right now. What Bitch Lynn do this time? I got called in over my bay hoodie, and then she got all on my ass over doing well in civics. Why no, wouldn't she be happy about nine. that? She thinks I'm cheating by not actually doing community service. It's like suspicious or whatever. You're not actually doing community service? Yeah, I am. You're selling drugs in PG County. I remember County. How does that Bench help their was I have really good prices. Giving pregnant women two for ones on crack rocks Obey. doesn't benefit the country. Bench. Oh, what, so now pregnant women have less rights than the rest of us? No, okay, do whatever the fuck you want. That's what I planned on. You want to come with me tonight? I'd rather date my ugly math teacher. How would you rather do that? Because if the police show up, I won't be the one getting arrested. Man, I was going to cut you in and everything. All right, then suit yourself. Oh, uh, so you in school or? Yeah, that's what the hour sheet's for. After tonight, I'll probably be all done. Cool, cool. Yeah, I thought you got out to prison or some shit. Right? But no, I'm too white and pretty to go to jail. Hey, the fuck, bitch? You wild saying that shit. You wild, you anything. <laughs> what, do you want me to lie? Yeah, yeah, I guess. Uh-huh. Well, I got packs to move, so if you could... Nah, yeah, I'll see you some other time with it. At least we have a repeat customer. Awesome has this many repeat customers. Oh my gosh, she's just like me for real. Uh oh, that's a fed. That's a fed. Is this, a cop? this is a this is a fed. Girl, hey, run! A cop, do you have to tell me that you're a girl? Cop? Run! Run! White guy buying rocks in PG. Yeah, you're definitely a cop. I'm not a cop. Wait, Mr. You sound is that Mr. Katz? Keep your voice down. Did Miss Lynn send you to spy on me? No, just take the money and let me leave with it. Holy fuck, you weren't missing class because you're sick. You're a crackhead. I said keep it down. I mean, if you want to buy, no problem. But are you allowed to sign my hour sheet? This was your charity? <laughs> yeah, I sell shit for cheap. I'm the great white hope of PG County. I thought it was a pharmaceutical charity. Medicine rocks? Yeah, as in crack rocks, duh. That's downright evil. Wait till I tell the school board you're cheating on your hours. Wait till I tell the school board you're buying ready rock off one of your students. Fine. We'll yeah, which one's worse? Shit. Now give me the stuff. Done deal. Selling crack or doing crack? <gasps> oh, shit. A little midnight marketplace here? How'd you let the cops tell you? Actually, sweetheart, the cops tailed you. We got a tip from a school principal across the Potomac. Shit! We got a runner! What the fuck? Uh, now we gotta call in a body bag. Did you just kill my civics teacher? It was a calculated risk, but it paid off. Dude, just shoot me too. I can't fucking handle this shit. Nonsense. Quick, reach you for the gun. Right to remain silent. Anything you say can and will be held against you. In the you waited two weeks to I'm, visit me. Are you? Okay, oh, if you're gonna are you be a bitch about it, I can go now. No, I'm so bored in here. Don't go. That's what I thought. So how's jail? I've been trying to kill myself every day for the last two weeks, but there's like really no they would options. put her in jail. The loony bit, and there's no I thought they would give her all. community and hours for like doing no community hours. The sheets rip easily, and the guards walk by every hour, so you can't even bleed out with the razor blades. Wait, how long are you even serving? The public defender was like three years with good behavior. Three you trying years. Trying to kill yourself over three years. I only came here It's that I long for, for selling crack. How many years for selling crack? You can serve up to seven year jail term. Yeah, but what's the minimum? I'm not selling crack, I just want to know. Wait, if it's a first offense in Canada, um, a maximum fine of a thousand, imprisonment up to six months, or both. 
Wait, for a subsequent offense, the maximum fine increases 2,000, while the maximum imprisonment cannot exceed one year, or both. Hey! Where to buy cr- <laughs> 20. Two weeks in here feels like 20. There's only one TV in the whole block, and all it plays is UPN reruns. And that's not even around I can't. Anymore. I can't sell crack, because, like, it would clash with my other job hours. My schedule doesn't line up, so. Yeah, so I'm going insane. They lock you in here to turn your brain into mush. Fucking every night you try going to bed, you just hear weird echoey moans in the distance. Why are they moaning? I don't know. You can't tell whether they're having sex or withdrawing from heroin. Wow, sounds kind of like torture. But I guess that's how the system works to make you not sell crack anymore. It's a broken ass system. They just assume we hustle for fun. Well, yeah, I mean, aren't there other things you can do besides selling drugs? Not for us. You're born into bullshit. No tools to get out of it. Yeah, I had literally like no choice. Fault. I had to sell that crack. I, I had to because I needed community hours. There was nothing I could have done there. They want to act like you want to be in jail, like you didn't know the consequence. No shit I knew, but it's either suffer out there or suffer in here. And when you get out, it's even more bullshit. PO, ankle monitor, drug test. I'm not selling record. white label crack and I'm not adding vitamin D to it and making it gluten free. It's almost like you had less problems on the inside. I the don't sell crack. For everyone but the prisoner. This is a maze and we're the rats. But most days you'd rather die than Where's get my cookie finish. package anyways? I thought I no, got sent one. Think about is dying. I guess 50 was right. Right about what? Is get rich or die trying. I did what I had to. You're white. <laughs> what? You're white, Nicole. What? You didn't have to do anything. That's what you think. What I know is we live in cul-de-sacs, and you don't have to sell crack when you live in a cul-de-sac. I didn't even totally mean financially. Like, my parents were mean to me and shit. It, like, makes you make bad decisions. You sold crack to a pregnant woman because your mom was mean to you? Um, yeah. So yeah. So all you did was take your little problems and turn them into someone else's bigger problems. They weren't little to me. You better turn Islamic and pray the judge agrees with that. Can white people be Islam? I don't know. Look, I gotta go. I'll see you next week, maybe. Oh wait, no, no, don't go. <laughs> be I Islam. Thought I had a oh. bad memory. Wait, crack ending. Until I spent two years oh, in shit. jail. No one has a bad memory. She got Some tatted are just up. More distracted than others. And aside from really cool fights breaking out, there aren't a ton of distractions in jail. I haven't had a visitor in 16 months. You go by months when you're locked in here. And you're left with your thoughts as your only entertainment. See, I went the in rolling my wire. eyes. Oh yeah, I'll learn. But they eventually break you down into this lame self-reflection, no matter how Wait, hard you Wait, my mom was it. just not even here? No Where's my mom? Here, no therapists in here. No nothing. So yeah, I feel like I've changed, but what if I'm getting worse? Every now and then I'm reminded what Jekka was trying to say last time she visited me. Every new inmate's story kind of paints the picture. One had to feed their kids. Another was forced in a gang. Some girl had to kill her husband. All I wanted to do was fill out an hour sheet. So compared to everyone else, I guess it was kind of messed up in the long run. Maybe that's my lesson. Two years ago, I never would have considered I'm wrong. I really have changed. Now to just serve my time, get back in society, maybe make some new friends. And buy a gun to murder my fucking principal with. I'd shoot her in the legs first. Watch her cry for mercy before I finish her off. Change feels pretty good. Nice barbed wire tattoos, bruh. Where am I? What other stuff is there? So then my ah. mom's like... Main menu. One? Wait, so I ran from the mall cop? What if I flirt with a mall cop after stealing the CD? Well, do you want the truth? Of course. See, we saw you standing guard over there looking so Is he still strong. gonna shoot me? We kind of wanted an excuse to get arrested, right? 
Uh, oh, yeah, we have a thing for handcuffs. Just being tossed around by an aggro man in uniform? Being back can have some good payoff sometimes. Uh, is there something you girls would like me to know? Yeah, actually, we want you to know your wife doesn't need to know. Totally. Your wife is probably such a bitch when you come home, <laughs> but we're two hot girls with no expectations at all. Huh. Well, my wife is a bitch cunt whore who I'm killing <laughs> first if I ever get fired. And see, that doesn't scare us off at all. Yeah, you're dangerous. We want you more now. You want to just forget about the CD and hang out somewhere? Top Golf just opened. Fuck Top Golf. Let's go to the Super 8. You're so naughty. How old are you girls anyway? Well, we're a package deal, so 34. 34 divided by two, that's, uh, hold on. Shh, you're a cop. You don't need to know math. So what if we're a little young? No one needs to know. Yeah, take us to Cancun where we're legal. I got a place where I'd really like to take you. Thailand? Downtown. Shit! Over fucking MSI CD? You miners thought you could pull a fast one on me, huh? Though I will admit, you both look very mature for 13. 13? And they let you have what? a gun? We can't all be algebra You can't do math. <laughs> Fuck. Wait, he, I didn't get shot what the this hell time. Is this again? The school sex addict rehab program. Lexapro. I need Lexapro. Just because we flirted with that guy? I know. We get the one male cop who isn't a pedophile. Is that our silver lining? Maybe the mall cop snitching to the truancy officer is. It's a little entertaining to see what kids we know here. Oh, hey! Didn't know you guys what? had to go oh, here, Oh, he's too. got a Triforce shirt. No. No, it's not. Hello? Earth to Nicole! Oh my god, make him go away. Jeffrey, how does a guy who sounds like a cartoon also have a sex addiction problem? Uh, can those not be together? Do you get turned on by the paperclip guy in Microsoft Office? <laughs> Sorry, I'm a Mac user. Is that why you're here? Yeah, Jacka, is that why you're here? Oh my god, totally. Clippy. Every time he pops up, I just want to rub against him. R rub against him? Ugh, that's so... Ugh, sorry. Last week we covered how to avoid sharing inappropriate thoughts with other girls. No kidding. I didn't oh, think you would be a Mac it? user, yeah. though. Is that why you're yeah, here? that's the weirdest part, well, is him being a Mac if user. If I why I'm here, then I'd be relapsing. Come on, we all need a relapse every now and then. Are you peer pressuring me? More like peer helping you. My volume ran out a couple months ago, but this morning I took so much of my mom's volume, I can't even feel What's my volume? lungs when I breathe in. I'm just zen. Yeah, and zen's a good ass fucking feeling, Jeffrey. Uh, okay, fine. I was in the after school game. I know it's a drug, but. Playing Jack and Dexter oh, it's like a Xanax? Too, and, uh, oh. What a setup for this. Yeah, so I'm playing it, and no one else was <laughs> around, and I just kind of felt like, you know feeling around down there yeah well one thing led well, to he another jerked off to and jack and dex i knew it dex i was to... out in the open touching with one hand while the other was still playing jack and daxter you jacked off to jack and daxter what no i didn't do it to jack and daxter i did it while playing jack and daxter <laughs> <laughs> and you finished and everything don't ask that i wasn't trying to do that I just spaced out, and eventually the club sponsor walked in on me. So I had to go here or else they'd expel me. You really put the Jack in Jack and Daxter, huh? So uh -huh. you're doing it, and <laughs> what's Jack and Daxter doing? He's just running around? They were running around. Jack and Daxter's two separate characters, Jekka. So you just told two girls how you got off to a video game, but you're more concerned if we know the characters in the video game. Uh, yeah. Why would you do that to a game for little kids? It's T for Teen. So is this a group thing? Did Daxter Jack 2? Uh, I never played Jack 2. I wouldn't know. <laughs> we need to get the fuck out of here. What are you talking about? He's probably the worst one here. Everyone else should be cool. Forgive me, Father, for I have sinned. Please make these urges go away. My cousin is not hot. My cousin is not hot. Okay, we need to get the fuck out of here. I wish we could walk out, but the principal's watching the door so hard. I think we're gonna need a distraction. Uh, get the sex addicts to fight. Huh. Hey, Kelly, 
What's up, Nicole? Jeffrey was just telling me how he wants to shove his face in your boobs. Uh, what? Well, hey, I didn't say that. Oh my God, Jeffrey, don't lie. The first step is admitting you have a problem. If you were attractive, I'd immediately let you, but you're just another ugly stalker. Yeah, keep it in your pants for once, Jeffrey. If I wasn't in a relationship with Jesus now, I would hurt you so bad. Okay, okay, please don't. But then he said that you were way cuter and less slutty than Ari. Oh my God, that's actually really <sighs> sweet. Thank you, Jeffrey. I'd still never fuck you in a million years. Same. Oh, so you think you can just talk shit about me? Oh, this she's in jealous. here? Bitch, I don't get jealous of Why sluts. is everybody in the sex oh, addiction? Yeah, I'm not a slut anymore, okay? I have a relationship with God and Jesus now. Is that who told you to sell your ass for an iPod Nano last week? Damn. Not even an iPod Elon? Nano. I don't even know what you're talking about. Face it, bitch. Jesus is a pimp and born-again virgins like you are his army of hoes. <laughs> hey, guys, let's settle down and try to be at least halfway respectful here. Why don't you fuck off and finish last, virgin? <sighs> you had it coming, Jeff. Oh, and now you have beef with Jeffrey? Sorry, didn't mean to insult your future customers. Do you actually want to fucking fight right now? Bitch, I brought a knife to school. Don't even try me. Yeah, right. What are you going to do with that? Stab you and watch the ski pour out? Not if I choke you first. I'll spit in your face. I'll spit in your mouth. I'll like it. <gasps> What's happening? Shh. Will you spit in mine back? I'll bite your bottom lip and make you fucking bleed. Promise to kiss me after. No, no. <laughs> Help me, Jesus. Help me. It's not love. It's just lust. It's not love. It's just lust. What the fuck? Okay, girls, break it up. Oh, now you stop them. One phone call and I can lock you both into a real rehab program. Is Let's this go. normal in oh, schools? Yeah. To have a sex really addiction rehab room? Here. I don't want to think about sex for the rest of the month. No, yeah, yeah oh, sure. okay. God, imagine being those girls. For a week, it'd be kind of fun. You want to be sexed up abusive lesbians? Fuck no. Why not? Because you'd be doing all the abusing. Oh, like what? Just weird shit? You'd like... Put a cigarette out of my neck and lick the burn mark. How very Lana so Del Rey. No. Fine, whatever. You never told me that Ari girl was so ghetto. Ari's not fucking ghetto. She's like the worst. That sounds girl like I something Lana met. Del Rey would sing about. You put the cigarette out on my neck and then you kiss me there in the summer. She had a knife on her. Because she was a Girl Scout. It's just a pocket knife. They don't have pocket knives in the ghetto? Nicole, trust me. She's kiss her brother on the lips white. Hello, girls. We're not talking about kissing, are we? Uh, no. It's all right. I'm your counselor. You can trust me with anything. No, I was just telling her how white some girl is. Now, now. That sounds like it might be name-calling. You remember our bullying Wait. assembly last year, correct? Why are you... Um, here? I was informed that you both attended the sexual addiction rehab meeting yesterday and just wanted to follow up with you. Oh no, it wasn't that deep. We just flirted with a cop. How deep was it then? You really get paid to fucking work here, don't you? I'm certainly sensing a lot of hormonal tension from the two of you. As always, if you'd like to explore these urges, my office is right around the corner. What the fuck is that supposed to mean? Teachers are broke, right? I think so. Why? I think so. If she has a part-time job as a mall cop, we could really use this to our advantage. The only normal adult is probably the principal-ish? No way I'm ever doing that again. What if he had a part-time job as security for an MSI concert? I'd practice flirting in the mirror to get in for free. Are there no limits with you? Bitch, you have no limits. You want to put a cigarette out on my neck? Oh, whatever. So, are you going to class this time, or And what the are civics you? teacher is just that he wanted crack. Yeah, I guess that's true. I haven't been to theater class. Crispin? Here. Emily? Uh-huh. Emily? Dude, I'm literally standing in front of you. Just making sure we do it right. Do what right? Taking attendance. Nicole, tardy. The fuck you mean tardy? I'm here. Meaning you're late? Since when you are you in charge of fuck? that? You're a student like the rest of us. As of last week, not anymore. Miss Teagan made me student teacher while she's off working on a professional stage production. And what makes you so special? I was top of the drama class junior year. We can't have a bad actor teach the class. Well, I don't think you're a good actor either. You probably couldn't even lie to the police. Yeah, honestly. Don't take her side. Why not? She's right. Because I'm your student teacher and I have the power to write you I up. Any other questions? Oh, I don't Has know. a guy ever killed himself while dating you? <laughs> so anyway, today we'll break up into two separate groups. One will do a table read exercise, the other will be improvised acting. 
So who wants to do what? I don't want to do anything. The teacher isn't even here. Can't we just hang out? Why would you sign up for drama if you don't even care about acting? It's a fuck around class. Like we're going to be actors one day? Yeah, no offense, Megan, but you're kind of not pretty enough to be in movies. I don't get why you want to act. Acting isn't about looks. It's about talent and creativity. When's the last time you saw an ugly girl star in a movie? Stop calling me ugly. <laughs> no, I'm not calling you ugly. I am. You're just like... Uh... Like what? You look like the girl from Harry Potter, but not photogenic. Oh, yeah, I see it. <laughs> all right, I'm done with this. Get in your groups or I'm writing all of you up. Um, group improv. So how do we do this? I give you guys a scenario and you play it out and get feedback afterwards. Oh, uh, yeah, it makes sense. So the scene is you're a newlywed husband and wife in 1949, and the wife wants to know what the war was like. What if he doesn't know uh, what the war was like? It was 1949. Everybody was just getting out of the war, or at least knew someone, right? Okay. Okay, so, so we go now? Yeah, uh, action. Hey, you seem kind of upset. Is there a thing you want to talk about? <sighs> nah, I'm good. Oh, well, do you want to hear about the war? No. Wait, wait. <laughs> Megan said you can never say no for improv. It just makes it go nowhere. That was the plan. Well, I guess don't do that. All right, let's try this again. Uh, hey, okay. wife, something on your mind? Yeah, uh, there's something I've been wanting to say lately. Minus oh, one. what's that? The N-word. Wh why would you want to say that? It's 1949, isn't it? Don't we usually say the N-word? Oh, may maybe, yeah. The N-word is probably my favorite thing to just scream in public with no repercussions. Nicole, no! A great year, for us anyway. Uh-huh, I'm glad you're happy. Yeah. Oh, do you see that? See what? That different colored family pulling up in a Lincoln? You want to do the honors? But she's RP. Calling them the N-word, duh. Why would I do that? She's it's 1949, why wouldn't you? Oh, right, um... Is there anything else you want to talk about? <laughs> to yeah, do you want to join the KKK? It's normal right now. No? Dude, what the fuck? Megan! What's the matter? Crispin said no during the improv. What the hell, Crispin? We went over this. No, but... Another no. I told you to get this that very word high out of your school. vocabulary if you're gonna do this exercise. Yeah, but the situation got kinda... The situation doesn't matter. It's improv. No matter what, you never use that N-word. If you do it again, I have the power to fail you for the quarter. Wait. All right, so, uh, resume scene. But yeah, honey, should we sign up for the 1949 KKK initiation? N okay. Great to hear. By the way, could you tell me about the war? Oh, and use the N-word as much as possible when describing it. And scene. Oh, all right. So how'd we do? Uh, I'm gonna have to talk <laughs> with Megan. Shit. <laughs> Nicole? Dude, the class oh, is no. over. What do you want? I just needed to have a little talk with you about uh -oh. your participation today was a little concerning, gonna be honest. Okay, is that it or? You're not getting it. I am your teacher in this class and you'll treat me as such. This disingenuous attitude isn't gonna fly in my program, got it? Dude, what the fuck ever? I just told you don't treat me like your classmate. I'm your teacher. Is that how you talk to your teachers? Actually, yeah. yeah. Don't lie to me. Oh my God, chill out. If you don't get your shit together, I'm gonna call Miss Tegan and tell her everything. Then she's gonna write you up for in-school suspension. Still think it's <gasps> all I'm gonna get suspended, I'm gonna get homeless. Yeah, sure, a side note. Are you withdrawing from bipolar meds right now? Don't change the subject. We're talking about you and your issues right now. Jesus Christ, okay. Think you can just smirk while Emily calls me an ugly Hermione? I had no part uh, of that. Go oh, ahead. that's what she had a problem again. with? No, thanks. Uh, can I go? Aw, oh, see, <laughs> now you get it. Now you're treating me like your teacher. Okay, Megan. It's Miss Megan. Miss Megan, can I get the fuck out of here now? You're excused, sweetie, but work on that foul I language. thought it was something with the... the... Fucking therapist, holy shit. I thought it was... So a... then she won't shut the fuck up over how special color TVs were. Who was this again? The English sub today. She was so old and talkative. At least you can go on your phone, right? That was the worst part. She'd stop her boring story to yell at anyone with their phone out. A sub that won't let you screw around. What a See, by the time I, I went to was... school, you could just put your phone on your desk. And most teachers were chill with it, as long as you didn't touch it. People would just leave it on the on the desk. Manages to be more boring than the regular shit. Weird. Thanks, yeah, Ragnar. 
How'd that go? The drama teacher nominated a student to teach the class while she's out of school. What the fuck? I know, why would she pick a student, right? No, why are you in drama? It's a gimme class. Don't worry, I have no intention of being an actor. Good. I didn't the drama I kids are so fucking school. annoying. They're all ugly yet somehow think they're gonna be in a movie one day. Yeah, that's pretty much the student teacher, who's a massive bitch, by the way. Do I know her? Do you know Megan? I was in second grade with her. Why is she a bitch? So I'm just doing whatever, not really caring. And then yes. she stops me outside after class and gets super in my face about it. And still you weren't acting good enough? I guess, but she's like, I'm gonna fucking write you up, get you suspended, like all this shit, and I'm just standing there. Oh, that makes a lot of sense now. Sense how? Wait, she was texting, if you T9 text, that's more accurate than trying to text without looking now. That literally would be easier to text that way. Or you have to press like one, two, one would be like A, B, C, and then two would be like D, F. I'm a kid in second grade. Every week like, do, 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 do. Once a tantrum kid, always a tantrum kid. Yeah, control And then they had the blackberries that you could so you slide the keyboard up or down. Yeah, I'm good. I'm gonna drop her ass though. Aren't you a little old for revenge? Oh, so now you're taking her side? No, no. I old support ass. you. I'm just not getting involved. Because you have such a future, right? Apparently more than you. Future or no future? Revenge is a dish best served cold. Like pizza. Well, do you seriously eat I pizza, want pizza cold? pizza. Yeah, what's wrong with that? Now I know you're out of your fucking mind. Hot pizza's just grease. There's what? grease in cold pizza. It's just solidified, schizo. Okay, can we talk about this in the courtyard? What for? I prefer to be told I'm crazy outside where it's warm, not in the mental ward-like cafeteria with freezing cold AC vents. Just hold your pizza up to one you'll like it more. I played and Snake tickets, on my dad's right? Nokia. Uh, tickets for what? Oh my god, you really forgot again. The dinner theater? Oh, uh, yeah, I can, like, order those tonight still. Don't bother, I'll do it myself. Sorry, yeah, okay. If you were actually okay. sorry, you wouldn't have fucked it up the first time. Yeah, I'll, I'll try better next time. This Hunter She's got seems enough a little class. Does this bitch just yell at all our students? He's our student, too. What do you mean, student, too? They're dating, you didn't know that? No, oh, really? it checks out. I thought it was kind of weird he was the only one in class not making fun of her. He's just chill, I guess so. He's flirted with like three of my friends so far. Not surprising. A bitch like her, I cheat on her too. She's in that weird category of just barely pretty enough to be super demanding. God, the sex with her must be so bad. I don't even think she he's getting that. She has a purity ring. Catholic, like super prudish. Do you just know everything about this bitch? What? I bet him brown longer, you just hear this shit. All right, don't worry about it. Cause I think I have my in. And for what? Megan's life. A boyfriend she isn't fucking is the perfect weakness for me to exploit. Where is this going? Am I gonna to fuck like her boyfriend? Red tube. Red tube. Okay, just checking, because every video on Who there even sounds uses exactly like red that. tube anymore? Like, oh, you killed my parents. I'll show you with the most suffocating blowjob ever captured on video. Dude, how much red tube do you watch? <laughs> Don't worry about it. Fine, but anyway, me and Red, Hunter share I know a it's zero nine. Next period. Oh nine. That's convenient. What are you gonna do? Let's just say I'm this gonna very oh nine. order a hot pizza and wait for it to get cold. You know me so well. Hunter would FaceTime another girl in front of and Yeah, a hundred percent. That's why I wasn't super broken up when my wife killed herself. Any questions? Jeffrey. Yeah, what's our science lab going to be about today? I meant questions about my wife killing herself. Oh, sorry, no. So for today's lab, we'll be identifying which element is which based on its mass and volume. Get into your groups while I grab the supplies. Oh, my partner's out today. Damn, that sucks. Are you going to be okay? Uh, yeah, I guess, but it's gonna be bullshit effort doing it alone. I could partner with you if you want. Really? I thought you hated this class. Well, we're both in drama, so it might help to know each other if we're gonna act. I thought you hated that class, too. I'm warming up yeah, to Yeah, he's it. wearing but a Nicole, Punisher shirt. I thought we were lab partners. Shut up! Shut the fuck up! Go away! Oh. <laughs> Wasn't that kind of harsh? Yesterday, he was telling me about how he kills dogs in his backyard. I can't work with someone like that. Huh. Yeah. Okay, I guess that was justified. God, Hunter's so stupid. Cool. You don't mind if I look at porn on my phone, do you? Uh, no. Awesome, yeah. It's something I do when I'm bored. That's not TMI, is it? Uh, I'm okay with it. 
Wait, but, don't look. Uh, don't they know if you look at porn on school, school Wi-Fi? Kind of add something to it. I don't know. So what are you doing after school? I gotta go to the dentist for. They'll probably academy. block. They always make me gag with all those tools. I hate it. Can't relate. You like the dentist? What? No, I meant gagging. I don't have a gag reflex. Oh, nine oh, through nine. So lucky. I don't think luck had. Wait, he wishes he doesn't have I a like gag reflex. My limits. Oh, you mean like, uh. Yeah, like that. But don't worry, I know Megan's your girlfriend. I won't cross any lines, I'm just honest about myself. Uh, honesty's good, I don't mind it. Sweet, I think we'll get along just fine in drama. By the way, I realized you're technically dating your Do they teacher. know if he has hotel Ultimate Wi-Fi? Fantasy, right? Um, I guess so. Probably, She's but they probably don't care. Too. Do you guys ever roleplay? No. This is the exact so scenario I was talking about. I, I know! Out after acting at school all day, right? Yeah. I guess you could say that. But me personally, I love role playing. Oh, cool. Well, what are some things you play? You have a girlfriend and you're asking me about my role playing? Oh, no, 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 no. I'm, I'm sorry. I didn't mean. Dude, relax. I'm fucking with you. Honestly, you don't need to worry. I have a sixth sense. Nicole's for fucking insane. And I can tell Megan's a lot of fun. You can? How fun is she? Okay. Don't tell her I told you this, but just based on her personality, I can tell she gives amazing head. Am I right? Uh, your sixth sense might need some work. Oh God, was I wrong? Is she really bad at it? She doesn't really do any of that. How long have you been dating? A few months now. Wow, I'm really sorry you're in a relationship like that. Do you want my number in case you want to vent or anything? Yeah, okay, I'll punch it in. Now that you mention it, the relationship does feel kind Dude, of... Dude, this is exactly it! It's it crazy! Just trust me. It's I know wild. all about manipulative relationships. Okay, so this is a romance it's crazy. improv. We're gonna need this to see who's best for our mini-production of Romeo and Juliet. Who's going first? Well, we need a guy and a girl. Hunter, why don't you go first? Oh all my right, god. Sure. Now, who's gonna play the other side? Emily? This is for romance? Yeah, romance improv. No, he's ugly. <laughs> I'll do it. <gasps> Seriously? Yeah, I won't get better if I don't practice, right? Okay, go ahead. What's the scene again? You're about to go to prison for 10 years, and this is your last conversation with your girlfriend. Scandalous. Oh. This might be the last time we ever talk face to face. <laughs> Are you sure? This might be You'll the be last the time. I know you will. My lawyer said it's not looking good. If I'm lucky, I'll get out in five for good behavior. Well, you're just gonna take that? You're free now, aren't you? What do you mean? Let's run away to Mexico. They won't find you there. I would, but this ankle monitor isn't doing me any favors. Just cut it off. Why are we trying I to get her BF again? Scissor. I think, I think cause we're trying to get revenge on her because she was a bitch. Like that's it, I think. There's yeah, okay, that makes sense. So you're really just gonna serve the time? Yeah. No other options. But what about me? What am I gonna do with myself without you? Do you think you can wait for me on the outside? And Nicole's know. a sociopath, All yeah. All your friends really wanna have sex with me. Look, I can't control you from the inside. Just keep me in the dark about it. You're giving up that easy? I don't have I any scissors. you loved me. I guess not enough. You're just telling yourself that to feel less bad about missing me. But actions speak louder than words. Whenever you touch me, I know the truth. But, but what am I supposed <sighs> to do? Touch me one more time. Take me to my limit with your last night of freedom and don't ever forget the feeling. Uh, 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 and scene. What? We can't keep going? That's enough, Nicole. Okay, who else wants to try? Maybe a little too scandalous. Emily, do you know where to buy whippets without getting carded? Uh, <laughs> Try no, to get whippets. Sorry, I don't even do whippets. Trying to huff whippets. Because you really look like a girl who does whippets. Oh my god, thank you. Little weird she took that as a compliment. Nicole, I need another talk with you. Shit, I went overboard. Over what? Nothing. So what's the problem this time? Actually, there's no problem at all. I just wanted to let you know oh. I really appreciated the effort today. Seriously? Yeah, your scene with Hunter today showed a lot of passion and actually kind of moved me. It's like you were really trying to make him fall in love with you. It showed a lot of talent. Oh, well, okay, thanks. And Nicole, I just wanted to say I'm Maybe really she's sorry into it. for being so hard on you. 
At first I thought you were just another disingenuous white kid taking drama because it's easy, but you really care. Yeah, I guess. So thanks, I'll see you later, Megan. They really uh, like pointing cool. out that they're white. Yeah? I told you it's Miss Megan. You know World Star Hip Hop? No, what's that? <laughs> it's this video site with nothing but Waffle House fights and blood implants gone wrong. Star. Blood implants? Yeah, I don't get it either, but when they screw it up, it just slides around in their leg. Ew! Ew gross. Do you want to see it? Yeah. Yeah, but later. I'm texting someone right now. You've been on the phone, like, all day. Who are you talking to? Little Caesar's cold and ready. Oh, I almost forgot. Yeah, how's it going with Megan's boyfriend? Look at that Making some pretty good progress. And so far, I got 10... 11 pictures of his dick so far. God damn, he's desperate. Yeah, but I'm trying to get one with his face in it too so I can prove it's him. Yeah, or else that could be anyone's dick. But what if he's just tricking you with a picture of someone else? Why would a guy carry around 11 angles of someone else's erection? He could be gay. He's definitely not gay. No gay guy would skeet in his mom's jewelry box for me. What's that uh, mean? Why would he do that? in his mom's jewelry box. Huh? I told him it would really turn me on, and within 90 seconds, he sent a picture of it. You oh. wanna see? Ugh. Yes. Look at this. Jesus Christ. It's Not like the Swarovskis! Oh, pearl necklace. What's that thing in the bottom corner? That's the head. Ew, uncircumcised! That's disgusting! Get it away! <laughs> you thought he'd send 11 pics of a photogenic dick? I'm gonna throw up! Uncircumcised men should fucking kill themselves! Maybe that's why you want to include his face. Well, you this is what teenage girls say, though, to be true. For you. Shit, you're right. Then it wouldn't be cheating anymore. Meaning it wouldn't hurt Megan anymore. Meaning you flirted with this guy for literally nothing. As it stands now, you're technically into him. I cannot let that happen. So, um, do we divide the mass by the volume? Couldn't tell ya. Um, or maybe we multiply duh. the density by the mass. Dude, duh. I'm feeling this mass anyway. Who gives a shit? Is something bothering you right now? Not really. It's just caring about science is for white guys who correct your grammar. Oh, right. Actually, there's sort of been something duh. I've been thinking about lately. Oh, mm. you don't correct my grammar. No, not that. Just us what about us i had fun texting last night did you not like it no i liked it too it's just i think about how i feel talking to you and compare it with talking to megan and i don't think she actually likes they do you look like siblings what? how so she just doesn't humor me the way you do it doesn't feel like she actually loves me are you sure i think you could stick it out a little longer i could but i don't really want to it's no fun being with some bossy prude. If she liked me for me, she would have done something by now. Hey, now, I don't think that's necessarily true. She just needs time. And they need to stay in the relationship for the revenge Even to so, work. Though, aren't I cheating on her if I keep this up with you? Keep what up? Like sending you all those pictures? <laughs> you mean when you came in your mom's jewelry box? Did anyone need my help over here? Yeah, actually, for the- No, we're fine, just thinking. Okay. Jeffrey, could you draw a better picture of my dead wife? Jewelry box? <laughs> Why is he so... Yeah. <laughs> Why is he so... I was really hot by the Hung way. up about his really dead wife. So? I, I had another one like that, but I forgot to send it. Another jewelry box? No, it was on my brother's Uno collection. Uh, like... Like Uno the restaurant? No, Uno the card game. Oh. Dude, I, How can you I thought this guy of was Uno? normal. Like all out of different versions, NFL Uno, Batman Uno, Simpsons Uno. And you just put them all together and blew a fat load on him? Yeah. I don't and think anyone's normal. I was, it, I was <laughs> thinking about you and, oh God, listen to me. What's wrong? Tyler is We're funny. We're just having a normal conversation. Megan has no idea we're doing this. It feels kind of messed up. Look, it's perfectly okay. Just think about it like this. Your relationship with her is a long-term romance kind of thing, like dating and whatever. She really loves you, but needs time for the rest of it. Well, yeah, but the time is killing me. And if time's the issue, you just need a Are friend they about to kill time the, with. Uh, having but sex? what would Megan think? Megan doesn't need to know. If she won't explore your urges, there's nothing wrong oh, with okay. finding someone who will. Besides, it's only cheating if you say you love me. It's not Seriously? cheating if it's in the ass? Yeah, it's been the rule since forever. S as long as we don't kiss and do all that mushy stuff, we can hang out however Them's the we want. Them's the yeah, rules, yep. Yeah. Cool. Them's the rules. Like that. That's what I'm here for. 
So, are you doing anything tonight? Actually, I wanted to invite you to something. For real? What is it? Do you want to go to church with me this Saturday? Megan canceled on me. No. Uh, I'm sorry, church? Yeah, it's a parking lot function with food and games, but also little ceremonies in the middle to appreciate the Lord. The Lord? Like Jesus? Yeah, the one and only. So you snap pictures of your penis while frequenting a church? Yeah, I know, but that's what confession's for, right? And you're gonna tell a priest you came in your mom's jewelry box? Yeah, I'll have to this Sunday, huh? Oh, Go yeah! Father for I was told, like, people that grow up in a really Catholic area, they have to tell their, their priest, like, all that stuff. So, like... You know, if you're a teenager and you, like, have sex, you have to tell them all about it. And then there's just a guy in the community that knows everything about it. And you have- you're, like, conditioned to tell them. I have sinned. So you're telling me you blindly say to a guy all the sex shit you did over the week? You don't have to, but, father, I mean, they're kids. They daddy? think if they don't tell them, they'll well, die. I We're to hell. What do you mean? Sorry, Red Tube. What's- so you want to go? Nicole. Please report to the counselor's office. Repeat. Nicole, Wait, what did I do? Report to the counselor's office. Thank you. Looks like I gotta go. I'll get back to you on that though. Just let me know by Friday. What did I do? Am I did I sell this crack is the again? First time being here is less awkward than where I just was. Nicole, hope I'm not interrupting too much with your class. It was actually the perfect amount of interruption. Regardless, I wouldn't want to knock you off of your newfound drive. Driving where? I meant your effort. Your sudden passion for scholastic participation. Since when? Did you just lie to get me in here? Of course not. You're saying that you haven't gone the extra mile in theater and science lately? Your teachers and both spoke very highly of you. Oh, uh, okay. they have? Yes, they're both very impressed with your sudden initiative when it comes to participating in the classroom. Quite frankly, it's pleasantly surprising to hear, given your prior He's wearing that mustard cum biscuit counselor, colored it'd be shirt. important to know. What's the sudden inspiration? Oh, um, drama and science? Couldn't tell ya. I'm just really smart, I guess. Well, either way, I learned that to one from of our book. most beautiful students isn't just a pretty face. What a great opinion to have of a teenage girl. Not to mention a daring fashion sense. You have a knack for turning heads, don't you? Whoa, now you're really flirting. Nothing flirtatious about admiring a creative mind. You picked out such vibrant shorts. They shape you out very nicely. Sorry, I'll try not to show off next time. Nonsense. You're more than welcome to show <laughs> off in here. Why don't you give me a twirl? You're what? literally 40. Why do you want to see my ass? Now, Nicole, it's not about that. <laughs> it's Just not about that. Now, go ahead and give me that twirl. Dude, no! I'm white. There's nothing to see anyway. Can I go now? Oh, now that sounds like a low self esteem. If I could volunteer a ah! few more compliments. I'm gonna go while I can still voluntarily leave. Bye. I got your text. Sorry, I was caught up. What happened? I was in French too and called the weird kid Rugrats fetish and got held after. Like Rugrats the cartoon? Yeah. That's a really good day. What does that I mean? I know. Everybody laughed and the teacher made both of us stay after for me to apologize to him. But then after that, I was forced to say three nice things about him. While he was there to his face? Yeah, talk about awk as fuck. That's literally cruel and unusual Ock punishment. What'd you even say? One of them was, you don't smell that bad. Like, I had no idea what to say. Did he get turned on while you did it? Like, think of how often a regular girl would say something nice to him. Was trying to block that out. When he gets home, he's going straight for your Facebook summer photos. Crispin Shit, might be the most normal too. person so, so far, yeah. About? Megan's boyfriend? I thought she said the counselor was horny. Oh, that's like every week. I'm already over that. But no, her boyfriend is out of his fucking mind. Well, yeah, he sent 11 dick pics for nothing back. No shit. No. He invited oh, me maybe to he's church more weird than this one? Saturday. Isn't church on Sunday? He's so involved with the church, he goes more than just Sunday. Oh, he's one of those those. Is it really that surprising, though? I didn't think a guy who cheats on his girlfriend and photographs his dick would have a strong relationship with Jesus, I guess. Oh, yeah, no, I've seen it. I would so get off to your pictures if it wasn't for my faith in God. Like, okay, thanks. How'd you even get that far with a guy so religious? That's when I found out. Like, what the fuck do I say? I didn't know Jesus was the escrow in titty pics. What who does even escrow is Jesus mean? anymore anyway? Someone pedophiles find to say they're not pedophiles anymore? You think our counselor will ever find Jesus? Yeah, if Jesus is a 15 year old wearing oh. Juicy Couture. High hopes. Juicy, no so one's wearing Juicy. I guess I'll just go to a really awkward drama class tomorrow. How are you gonna tell him no? You just distract him. Hey, so I can't go to church, but you know what I 
do want to do? You know what I want to do really fucking badly? That was cool. How do you do that? Dude, 90% of dirty talk is just rhetorical questions. Yeah, you like that, you fucking... So like I warned last week, here's my casting for the school's Romeo and Juliet production. R word. Let's see, for Romeo we have... Wait, they made a play about Romeo? Uh, yeah, Romeo's It's a reference! Character. Isn't that Master P's kid? Why'd you take the little out of his name? No, as in Romeo Montague? <laughs> it's Shakespeare, we studied this all month. It's an old so Reddit post. Will Romeo and Juliet then? Yeah, what the fuck? Enough. So, playing the part of Romeo is Hunter. Congratulations. Oh, thanks. <gasps> a little more excitement? Can we applaud the castings? Yeah, yay, thanks guys. And playing the role of Juliet will be... Not me, not me, not me. Nicole! Yay! Seriously? Yeah, you earned it. I know we got off to a rocky start, but your onstage synergy with Hunter has really blown my mind. I can't think of anyone better for the part. I'll text you about rehearsal later tonight, Nicole. Cool. He's gonna yeah, send sure. a dick pic like this, coming on the script. Is everything. Good luck, you guys. You're gonna need it. Oh, you too. No, I don't want to talk about the fucking script. Just send the shit. What's going on? Nothing. Game oh, or brother. Dude, that does not sound like nothing. Who are you texting? A guy. Whoa, a guy? Is he getting serious? Ew, I'm not having this conversation with you. Is he asking for ass pics or something? Can you not? I can give you the ass pics trump card if you want to know it. Just so you can see it coming if he tries using it. What? what trump card? Oh, it's real simple. If any girl's holding out on me, I just make it about trust and how I'll kill myself <gasps> if she doesn't trust me. What? There's no way that works. No, it works like every... Well, not every time, but like 10% of the time. What girl would respond Wait, emotionally enough dude, to... Dude, the way that this was exactly what some pro gamers and streamers did when, like, certain DMs were leaked about these weird guys that it was like, please, bro, I'm gonna kill myself if you don't send me titty pics, bro, please. Suicidal guy begging to jack off to her. Well, you're a sociopath. You don't respond emotionally to anything. You wouldn't get it. Get the fuck out of here. Okay, suit yourself. But in case you fall for it, the light's really good in the bathroom. You're my brother. Yeah. Why would you care about the quality <laughs> of my ass pics? Does he have experience uh, no, uh, I gotta sending go. ass pics? They had to teach us about ancient Greece in school. Are you still there? Yeah, I'm still here. It's been 45 seconds, asshole. I haven't gotten anywhere on this full body pick, but let's try. Yeah, the Tainari, old Tainari VA. Me, I just want to see you all in one picture because it would be really, really. I got him. Got what? You know what? Blink tickets? They're not even together anymore. The pictures? Oh yeah, for the revenge you're still plotting. How's that going? Let's just say I have the key ingredient. He really sent you a picture with just everything in it? He sent a lot of pictures with everything in it. After the first one, the floodgates just picture? open. Why would he send that many pictures of the same thing over and over? Oh, I had him write different things on himself and send pictures of it. Stuff like loser, Nicole's bitch, Megan's a whore. Okay, this is cool getting kinky. So that's why you weren't picking up yesterday. Busy with the worst shit imaginable. I don't know. Last night was the closest I got to any sexual gratification in this whole plan. Literally how? Thanks it's just some ugly guy writing shit on himself. No, not the visual. Just the Definitely. raw control. Okay, she's into really some fandom awesome. shit. Nicole, that's what rapists say, just so you know. I mean, I guess, but like, I'm a girl, what am I gonna do? Guys will fly off the handle for barely anything. Yeah, guys will not get a Lego set when they're five and 30 years later molest kids over it. Exactly. <laughs> now on to the next step. Are you gonna post the pictures online somewhere? No, I think oh. I'm gonna hold on to these until the time is right. And what time is that? Oh, you'll know. I think everyone's Wait. gonna know. Run less than five this is gonna hurt Bones Hunter up. more Let's than together. Megan. Megan's number? Check. Picture of her boyfriend with his weird dick out? Check. Hey, Nicole. Good luck tonight. Oh no! Good luck to you too. But he is cheating. Wait, what? Send. We got two minutes into the first scene before Megan checked her phone. Honestly, I thought she wouldn't check till intermission. What an amateur. So she ran out on stage in the middle of a Romeo line, yelling out of control and just broke down crying in front of everybody. They were taking videos, laughing. It was pretty fucking cool, actually. Then she had to go to the ER for a panic attack, and that was really fucking cool. 
Jekka kept asking me why I'd go through rehearsing for a whole play, even though I knew it'd end like that. Well, I had a commitment. This is to euphoria. It. She was gonna see what was up. If I sent the picture as soon as I got it, she'd have time to resolve everything before the play anyway. There's no satisfaction in that. You see these movies where people kill someone for revenge, but it's like you're gonna let them off that easy? I didn't break a single law, and this is like ten times the payoff. She's gonna be mentally fucked for the rest of her life over this, and I just feel good about it. Now Megan's gonna end up a cat lady, cause any guy she dates will just remind her of me. Remind her what any girl's capable of if you push her far enough. What did Megan do to her again? <laughs> she said, it's Miss Megan. I'm your teacher. You have to talk to me like a teacher. <laughs> so we fucking broke her relationship. What if I do table reading? So just read aloud, but act it out as if you were saying it on stage. Who's playing who? Emily, you'll play the cadet, and Nicole, you'll play the captain. Swell. Uh, what do you think you're doing, young lady? Sorry, I'm just nervous. At least we didn't end up in like jail. That. Yeah, great. So you guys play out the scene. I'll be back in a bit. Nervous about what? Missing home? I am nervous about no, dying Megan's a student too. I didn't start. She's you better a, finish it, cadet. Uh, Why don't we start loving instead of fighting? This sucks. Yeah, no fight in you, huh? What the fuck is this? I'm back. How you guys doing so far? Decent. Yeah, this script's ass. Who wrote this? I wrote it. It's not ass. It's pretty ass. <laughs> it's JLo after her second kid ass. Like, you could write a better script. Is that really than ass? This? I totally could. About what? About oh my god, I saw there was like one of the it was like some tweet from some big like pop crave account that was like These four women combined are the top female singers and then it was like Ariana Grande Ariana Grande Beyonce J Lo and Selena Gomez. And then people, someone quote retweeted it and was like, oh my god, a sneak! And it ratioed the original tweet. Girl whose superpower is all her insides are poisonous. So, if some a people guy were like, oh my god, two her, sneaks. His eyes melt out of his head and he a dies sneak. in a slow, grueling pain. So then he can't deny it. That's good. Why wouldn't you just make it so her superpower avoids getting molested altogether? Who the fuck would want to watch that? Her superpower <laughs> is nothing happens. Wow, great movie idea. Can you just keep reading? It's for a grade, you know. Whatever. My heart beats to love, not fight. Who the fuck is this for? It reads like the anime cartoons Jeffrey likes. Who's Jeffrey again? He's the weird kid with glasses who draws pictures of girls he has crushes on. Oh, he would like shit like this. Guys, I'm right here. We know. Can you get back to reading? I gotta grade your acting. Oh my god, your heart beats to march, cadet. Hut one, two, three, four, hut one, two, three, smut? four. Uh, Nicole? What? I'm reading. It's like a drill, Sergeant. You read it like one, two, three, four. What? Do I remotely look like I'm even in the same universe of giving a shit as Is you Is this are? the one where she goes to her old house and then the guy's like, oh yeah, it is. We're the ones acting. Creative liberty. Exactly. Whatever. Keep going. Born. How can you march for someone else's death? I'll march this foot up your ass, ho. That's not what I wrote. Creative liberty. Acting doesn't work like that. You literally said acting's about creativity. Yeah, so is it about looks again? Maybe we should teach the class. F for the day! Damn, this class is easy. Nicole? Dude, the class is over. What do you want? I just needed to have a little talk. Oh, with she still you. talks to me? About. Your participation today was Wait, a so do I still want to do revenge? Okay. You're not getting it. This is the same. Uh, miss. 
Wait, do I even get any choices? Oh, it's the same? If you go in drama class, it's the same, huh? Oh yeah, it's the same. Okay. Make a gay girl cry. Oh no. I think I have to start from the beginning. It's funny when a girl t Hey, she and like, should I? Nicole, are you really trying to kill yourself again? Wait, yeah. what's this? No? What? Oh, I, I accidentally no picked something. Hold on. I need to restart here. Click Where's down it? here. Oh, oh, fine. So where are we even going? Why don't I just pick something else? Hang out at home. E you want to watch Mythbusters? This is like a really bad date. At least we're not in school. That's a horrible comeback for that. What are you going to do when you're 25 and working at Outback Steakhouse? Well, Dude, this is probably the fucking 25-year-old guy in chat right now working at Outback Steakhouse. I would never fucking work at Steakback Outhouse. That doesn't change the fact we're stuck here without gas money and your mom only pays for the basic cable package. So you don't want to watch Mythbusters? We literally just left school to avoid men who go, This is true! Where the fuck would I watch a show about them? I heard every other episode they accidentally show you a new way to make crystal meth. Did they ever do one on cigarettes causing cancer? Don't make meth, you're gonna if go to jail. If Star Wars, then maybe? Can I smoke in here? You can. I don't know if you should. My mom might get mad. Okay, I well, you hate your bit. mom and your brother and anyone else you mentioned to me, so just let me smoke in here. Holy shit, calm down. You've only been smoking for like a year. How are you addicted? Have an alternative? My mom has a bunch Wait, of old smoking? In her medicine like cabinet. cigarettes? You want to crush them up and see what they do to us? Wow, snorting your mom's pills. We'd be like the guy in Scarface if he ran a nursing home. This might be a stupid question, but what even is Scarface? It's like a drug dealer movie. I don't know. The ESL kids won't stop wearing shirts of it. I think they did a Mythbusters on Scarface. That sounds so awesome for a guy who wears cargo shorts. What are we doing, Nicole? And don't say sobriety. Do a line of mom's pills. I think the pills could be a lot more fun than you're expecting. How's that? My mom has problems, dude. And she's old, so the doctor just writes her whatever she wants. What, are we gonna snort polio meds? Don't they have a vaccine for that? Not when she was born. Look, she goes to a new psychiatrist after every divorce, and they keep giving her the good shit because she doesn't move over the medical history. Oh, that's oh, so that's smart. Nice My mom only gets the daily Prozac shit after they cut her off from Valium. She should get divorced. New health plan, new psychiatrist. My mom hasn't worked in like 20 years. I don't know if she can even <laughs> function without my dad. Oh, Can't she just find a new guy? My mom does. You haven't seen my mom, Nicole. She stopped trying like 10 years ago. I don't think you can ever come back from that. Yeah, after the mom jeans, it's just over. Tragic. Thanks, now I have to think about how sad my mom is. This is why I'll never get married. This is why we should do those pills now. Come on. Why does it hit so fast when you start it? Fuck. Doesn't Vicodin always hit like that? I never tried it. No, it takes like an hour when you take it like a pill. Wow. Prescriptions what do they have a lighter for? Anyway. A line of it does a little at first, but then just creeps up fast. Here, try it. Oh my god, I'm scared. Is my nose gonna bleed? Only if you do it like a million times. Oh. <laughs> what the fuck? How does your mom function like this? She doesn't. What if she needs these later? It's easy to get more. She can make an appointment and pay like two bucks for a whole bottle. They won't cut her off or What the anything? fuck is Vicodin? Yeah, that's the one perk to being old. If you want enough drugs to shut off your emotions, they won't assume you'll try to OD or anything. Yeah, they say Painkiller? Is it addictive? Pills. It's so bullshit. Like, even if you wanted to do that, it's like... Like... Very. Like, oh. none of their business shit it's really hitting now. Oh yeah, I feel it too. It's like Percocet, but not as good. You could say that about any painkiller. You want to watch Mythbusters now? I am nowhere near fucked up enough to watch Mythbusters. You should watch Shrek. Shrek came out by now, now right? Why the fuck do you want to watch Mythbusters so bad? Uh, I don't know. It's the only thing on when I skip. Uh, okay, give me something good. You want to try a mystery pill? I'm not even looking at the label, but I'll crush it up. Mystery Ibuprofen? Pill? What if it hurts me? Dude, you're viked up. You're good. All right, fuck it. Line it up. <laughs> Is it good? Oh my god. Oh my god. What did I do? I don't feel anything. Really? She always has Oh, now drink shit. alcohol. What if it's just a Claritin or something? No, my mom barely has allergies. Let me read the label. Metroprolol. Generic for 
beta lock. Beta lock? What the fuck is that? It's for, right? It says, use for high blood pressure or tightness of chest. Yeah, let me do a line of beta blocker. Oh god, it's hitting. There's a name for it? How'd you know that? What? The chemistry teacher told us about it last year. Miss that class. Wait, that what? was the last pill, too. My mom must take a lot of these. I'm like deflating in my own body. What? How long up is your mom to always need these? We don't really talk about that. She just comes home and yells at me. I would yell at you, too. Why the fuck didn't you tell me it was a beta blocker? I think you're missing the point of the mystery pill. I took it with Vicodin, Nicole. Call 911. Dude, you're gonna be fine. Worst case just scenario, breathe. you pass out. Why do I feel like a guy's told me that before? Just oh, breathe. Chest pains. One pill left, just gotta get up these stairs. The women at Ross are so goddamn difficult. <laughs> Ross. Damn, Jekka, you're out cold. Nicole, why are you uh -oh. home? And why is all my medicine on the floor? Oh shit, hey mom, um, we were feeling sick, so we took a bunch of your pills. I don't have time for excuses. Just where's my beta lock? Beta lock. Um, what do you uh -oh. need that for? I feel like I'm having a heart attack. Why is the bottle empty? You took the whole oh, thing. Uh, Jekka was having a heart attack too. Oh god. Oh Everything's no! Dark. Call 911. Okay, mom. Mom? Oh. What the fuck? Mom? Fuck, where's the phone? There was one left. I. <laughs> fucking gone maybe i boofed it uh guys so how was the funeral when is expected meaning my aunt pulled out a gun weird that's somehow not <coughs> the most shocking well, thing you've told me in the last week yeah so there's this huge life insurance payout all the alimony is going to me and my brother tons of paperwork and none of it's worth any of the hassle because you can never replace her with money? No, there's a fucking trust fund and I can't touch it till I'm 35. 35? I'll a stipend. I can't move to LA or anything. What? Nicole, this might be a weird question, but uh, did you cry at all after your mom died? Holy fuck. No, but I used it to get out of some stuff. Does that count? It, you seriously need to be on something. I am. Something other than Xanax and Percocet. I have Vicodin Molly too Percocet. now. Do you really not get how Percocet. sad this is, or are you just fucking with me? Molly Percocet. Again, like, I'm sorry it went down like that. I was passed out, and I couldn't really... It's probably a lot to handle. Yeah, no shit. That's what I mean. Shouldn't you go to a therapist or talk to someone? Is this going to be a thing where you break down and cry Never for me, or are you chase doing this to make you feel better? Always chase a check. Can it be both? Chase a check. I'm going to class where you headed, Nicole. Keep skipping. If I go to theater class, I think it goes down the make the boyfriend cheat on the thing. I wonder what the guy from Cody Banks is doing right now. Oh, hey, Nicole. You over here, too? Oh, great. Yeah, I just, like, I couldn't even handle whatever was going on in class and stuff, and I just Never had to break loose from it all, you know? Check. Like, don't chase don't a check. Don't chase a check. Chase a check. Sometimes. That was the longest possible way oh, to say your- Oh, I've seen no, this. Like, and okay. then Ari comes Dude, in. I go- Oh, well, hold up. I'm not really like a bad- I'm real happy. Yeah, but- I mean, Wait. It's cool that you know- I- Dude, it, it looks kind of deep. Okay. Dude, I- Yeah. That What's going on out here? Oh, Torture. wait, no. Oh, hey, man. Oh, wait, no. Oh. She asked her Just, about her shirt. If he loses, he's gotta like- Take it- Oh, and then her! Oh. Wait, we can Wait. make her cry. Wait. Don't make me call security! Oh, I pick up the cocaine! You- Wait. No. I I my your cause, your sponsor depression. for depression, and then we can make the gay girl cry. I never. Yeah. Holy shit! Oh wait, schizophrenia. Yeah. Hold on. This is. Hold, oh. Do you like? Oh, here we go. Oh, this shit's fun. Fun? Why? You don't think it's weird to tell a girl you love her and then ask if she's gay? I... I guess I wasn't thinking... I don't know. So let's say I said yes, right? If you were my girlfriend, what would you do for me? I don't know. Anything you want? Anything? Damn. So any depraved ass shit you're just down for? For you? Yeah. Could I choke you while we make out? If you want. Could I smack the shit out of you in public? Yes, please. Ah, self-esteem. Am I too desperate? No, not your self-esteem. My self-esteem is through the roof right now. <laughs> How come? Because now that a girl wants me this bad, I'm like universally hot now. But you don't... Yeah, not really. Sorry. 
not there yet. Oh. Look, you're probably better off. It doesn't she is feel better, like off. better off. Speaking of off, you're not gonna off yourself over this, are you? Because if you do, will you leave me your eye touch? Why the fuck would I give my eye touch to a girl rejecting me? Sorry, it works with guys, never mind. Does this feel like a hole in your chest or what? I feel like I'm gonna be alone forever. I don't know any girl who's gay here. You could find out. How? Sex to pick of yourself to every straight girl you know. One of them's bound to be in the closet. Wh and if they're not? Worst case scenario, Don't they do board that. up to their boyfriends. He'll text back like, ha ha, what an idiot, but the picture will absolutely go in the rotation. Rotation for what? Look, I gotta go. Just forget what I said. Good luck, excuse stealer. Wait, what happens now? Bitch. She's not wrong. Do you like date movie? Is that the parody movie? Yeah, the one with the milkshake song. Yeah, it was kind of funny. I thought so too, but I was trying to watch it online and the movie website said it was three out of 10 stars. What? It wasn't that bad. I know. I tried clicking nine stars to bump it up and it said I had to <laughs> sign in. Did you? That's Who the funny. fuck has time for that shit? I just wanted to watch the movie again. Huh. That means all the Dude. opinions on the internet are only from weirdos with enough time to create an account. Bro, I tried to- I used to watch the movies on those fucking shitty cam rip sites and then you would see a guy get up in the middle of the movie and walk across the screen and you could barely make out the fucking like 100p resolution on some camcorder that you gotta open this way. Holy fuck. No, it's fuck. so dumb. Like maybe if you fucked a bitch you'd know a good movie when you see one. Are you saying that hating date movie makes you a virgin? I mean, basically. I mean, they got better cameras now. That. But no, so I go on the rest of the site, like, what did they think's a good movie? And all their nine-star movies are so boring. Have you seen The Godfather? I've heard of it. My dad made me watch it. I fell asleep. <laughs> How is that a nine? What else was high? Uh, uh there was American funny. History X, but I haven't seen it. That one's cool. Kind of long, though. What's it about? A racist guy? You like a movie about a racist guy? Like I don't know what that movie whatever. is either. Weird Christian bitch. What the hell was that? Yeah, I don't know where you what? got that. But so another movie was- Oh, look who it is. It's the school bigot. What? Don't play dumb. We heard what you said. And we heard what you did <gasps> to Ari. You what? You reject a gay girl, then have the nerve to say no one's homophobic here. Oh, so now conversations are worth broadcasting? I only mentioned it to one person. I didn't think it'd be a thing. Ari told people too. You're sick, Nicole. What? Pretending there isn't bigotry here. It must be nice to ignore it. What, are you gay? No. Then fuck off. You don't need to be gay to fight homophobia. I never said she can't be gay. I said no one here would hate her for being gay. Indifference is as bad as participation. What the I'm fuck not a did that bigot. have to do with what I just said? Do you just have a list of sayings memorized? Actually, we have a list of 500 signatures. What? I'm getting signatures canceled in 09? I'm you for gay bashing Ari. Damn, that's a lot. I what wasn't even gay bashing her. I just didn't want to go Over out with her. the last two days. And I think it's safe to say the people have spoken. Everyone we went up to immediately signed to fight homophobia. Okay, kind of proving my point. What point? That you hate gay people? If there's such a mass homophobia problem at the school, how'd you get 500 signatures with no pushback at all? Uh, so November ignorant. is a cursed the month. The Club weeps for you. Yeah, I don't think you're ready for a conversation about this. Come on, let's get more signatures. No! Homophobic? Come on, man. <gasps> Not even Hunter. Here? Yeah, this feels a little over the top. Can you, like, talk to people for me and clear this up? Hell no, not getting involved. Oh, Ari! Yeah? What's this shit about me hating gay people? I didn't tell anyone that, but they just kind of had their own conclusion. Well, what? can you tell them to chill out? Why the fuck would I do anything for you? You rejected me. This is bullshit. Oh, Ari, I got your picture. You did? Yeah, you looked hot as fuck in it. Oh my god, thank you. Would you want to try, like... No, sorry, I'm not there yet. Maybe in college. Dumbest advice ever. Who would advise her to randomly sext people? Oh, shit. What? Nothing. Show me the picture. No, get your own. As you might be aware, the school's GSA has been petitioning for your immediate expulsion. The fuck's a GSA? Gay Straight Alliance. What? So if a gay girl asks me out, I'm just not allowed to reject her? I'm not exactly sure that's what they're saying. The claim is that you bullied a gay girl by downplaying homophobia. Yeah, but I'm pretty sure this That's all became a thing. A thing that I was a go thing. Out with her. Well, I'm sorry, but that detail doesn't seem to be relevant in the documentation for this petition. Oh what do God. I have to do to prove I'm not homophobic? Make out with her on public access? Nicole, you know the public access stations wouldn't allow that. Don't be disingenuous. Okay, then Channel 4, 5, the CW, what? That's not what I meant. Well, what do I have to do? I believe the best course of action is writing Ari a formal apology letter to- Fuck that shit! Do you even know how I got involved with this bitch? Language! Do you even know how I got involved with this hoe? Slightly better. She stole one of my 
my homework excuses and I got stuck in group counseling with her. Ari screwed me over first. Nicole, this is like telling police they should arrest someone for selling you bad weed. I wouldn't put selling about well. a sense past her either. Look, it's either write her a letter, go to a sensitivity retreat, or be expelled. Sensitivity retreat? Is that like conversion what is therapy? That? Third person reverse conversion therapy. Huh? You have a week to decide. What the You're fuck excused. is that? What a waste of time. Karen? Homophobe. <gasps> oh, Karen? Your days are numbered, bitch. Holy <gasps> shit, get a hobby. Sucks, don't it? Okay, let's hear your dumbass insult. What? Pile it on. I'm a homophobe, right? You think I'm just another sheep, don't you? Wait, Is Kyle or... Are... dipshit? Don't get defensive. I've heard what they're saying about oh, you. Oh, oh. Let's just say I know a place that can help you out. Is what this the January 6th route? This situation? I don't know, maybe... The straight club? The straight club? <laughs> Shh, it's on the DL, dude. What the hell is the straight club? Just a place for us straights, you know? A group to avoid bitches in the GSA for sure. If they're so proud of being gay, then we're proud of being straight. I gotta be dreaming right now. That good, huh? More like so incredibly fucking stupid, there's no way it's we gotta, real. We gotta oh, see what's real, up in the straight you're club. Invited. I feel so special. Come on, it's fun. We make signs, plan events, talk about John McCain, have John pizza McCain? parties, just a wholesome get together. Is wholesome he like John Rock? Straight? 100%. Do you still have Percocet? I'll go if you give me some. Uh, all right, sure. Okay, where is it? Follow me. We can't disclose it verbally, okay? You're in luck too. It's straight club movie night. Oh, well, what kind of straight movies are we watching? Guys, Fight welcome Club. Welcome our new member, Nicole. Oh, what's up? Fancy seeing you here. Why am I not surprised it's all men? It's movie night, boys. We got the projector ready? No, nah, but I got it. Cool, let me help you. So you're in the straight club, huh? Let's not use the word in. Visiting, then. I guess. Why are you in the straight club? Isn't it obvious? Don't make me say it. Well, okay. Maybe it's kind of a long story. It all goes back to when I finally started narrowing down my interest to a couple key hobbies. Like video games and anime, for starters. Don't make me say it. And I love stuff like that so much, I wasn't afraid to tell anyone about it. But I didn't think so many people would find it annoying. My hobbies are practically my identity. And ever since middle school, I've been bullied for everything What does this have to do with I him have. being straight? Good. Yeah, that's what they said, too. I saw other kids get bullied for being gay or foreign, and everybody immediately rushed to their defense. But when I got bullied for how I talked or what I liked, no one really cared. Like, I wasn't supposed to be protected. Almost as if liking anime is a choice. Exactly. And that's when I realized no one's sympathetic when you're regular bullied. They only care if you're bullied for something you say you're born <sighs> as. Before they were jerks for bullying me, but with this new group, they're gonna be bigots. Oh, okay, they're quick. bigots. Except for if one you get thing. bullied for being What's straight. That? Why the fuck did you pick the straight club? I couldn't really pull off being gay. I get too nervous around girls. My friend Jasper loved cartoons and Amanda show, but then he came out as gay, and it was like no one was allowed to call him annoying anymore. He's very oppressed. He likes anime, yeah, games, and no is straight. Straight pride isn't going to make anyone want to protect you. Straights are way in the lead here. Well, if that's true, why do we have to be so secretive of the straight pride club? Feels like everyone gets a pride rally but us. It's called a Redskins tailgate. Uh, never mind. Let's I don't not know get that into means. this on movie night. Really not the time for politics. It's not politics. It's fucking dumb as shit. What teacher would even sponsor this? We couldn't get an official sponsor, but one teacher oh. agreed to under the table sponsor us. Okay, so what teacher would under the table sponsor us? Was it a counselor? This? Greetings, fellow oh, straights. I brought the movie, Nicole. Of course. Now that we got a pretty girl in the straight club, we're really in business. Dude, perfect timing. What's the movie this week, coach? It's not Rambo 3 again, is it? Nah, I thought we'd switch things up from the last four weeks. I got a very special copy they of American History watched Rambo 3 History three times? Seen it. I'm leaving. Not so fast, young lady. What makes it so special? See, when the movie first came out, it was great. Just a man proud of his heritage kicking ass. But then Hollywood had to come in and put in the I've never BS seen it. progressive agenda on the last part of the movie. So this is my copy of American what, History what's the last with the 30 last minutes? 30 minutes cut out. Who wants to watch? Well, I love directors. What's the last class. 30 I'm minutes? I'm going to get us some popcorn. Be right back. This is going to rule. So, Nicole, what brought you to the straight club anyway? 
Some he has a redemption arc? She's just being shy. Oh. Some dyke bitch told everyone Nicole was homophobic because she didn't want to date her. What the fuck is wrong with these gay people? I'm not blaming all of them. Yeah, that's what they always say, but these freaks won't stop till society's underwater. We should publicly execute those weirdos. What? Well, that's what I expected to hear at a straight club. What's her address, Nicole? Let's show that bitch a lesson. What? Oh, chill out. I don't know it. Don't hold out on us. Tell me where she lives or I'm gonna choke slam you into the sugar cube castle. I told you I didn't know her fucking address. Kyla, Kyla, calm down! This is way over the top. I don't get it, coach. I thought this was the straight club. I know, but you're being messy. Besides, I'm a teacher. I'll just look up a file and get the address that way. <laughs> what? Thing, coach. Get her address for what? Just gonna teach her and her family a little lesson in humility. Come on, straight club. First a student <laughs> files, then a drive down 95 where the gas is cheap. Down 95? Wouldn't that take forever? I'm not gonna burn her house down with expensive gas. What? Oh, we're burning yeah. her Let's house go, down? Boys. Finally, I, I thought we were just... Polos. I wonder if I'll get blamed for this, too. Who could help me out of this shit? Guys? What the? Where'd everybody go? Jeffrey, don't Maybe I don't should go. find something other than being straight. Yes. Maybe Jeffrey can be reformed. Come on, come on. Try not to get blamed for a hate crime. I'm watching Drake and Josh. This better be really fucking good. It's actually really oh, bad. Oh, jeez. Oh, we'll see you later. Dude, wait. What? I was invited to the straight club, and they're on their way to burn Ari's house down right now. We have to stop it. Okay, slow way the fuck down what the hell is a straight club the gym coach started an underground cult for straight pride they all think they're victims for being straight aren't we victims of being straight name one good boyfriend either of us had no it's all men oh how are they victims they're jealous of gay pride rallies that's all i gathered they should be they're fun it's the only place where you can make out with three different girls and feel proud of your cold sores the next morning Ew. Oh, so they're on their way to kill Ari right now. Oh, yeah. Why would they burn her house down? Because they heard she spread the homophobic rumor about me, and now they want revenge or something. They were set off, like, instantly. And so why is that your problem? I thought you hated her. Because it's a hate crime that I am going to get blamed for. These guys are insane. They watch American History X with the ending cut out. <gasps> but it's about a racist guy. Isn't cutting it down good? The end's where they learn how to not be racist. Okay, okay, I get it. Except for one little detail. What? Why the fuck did you come here? Call the police! When have the police ever done anything good for us? This is gonna be the mall cop <laughs> guy. Alright, let me get my shoes. She ain't wrong. Asleep? Ari? Ari! Why can't it be like the movies where they're just conveniently 10 feet from the door? It better be like the movies soon. When are they getting here? I think they went down to Woodbridge where the gas is cheap, so we maybe have a few minutes. The price is cheaper, but don't you burn that driving down there? It's not for their car. Oh yeah, to burn the house down. Drake and Josh is on. This better be good. What the fuck, still? Marathon. Had... What do you want? It's almost Oh, he said his your family address home? Her no, address. Town. What the fuck do you want? You gotta get out of here. Someone's on the way to burn your house down. What? Who would set my house on fire? Coach Colby Straight Club. They're mad at the general idea of homosexuality and want to kill you for being gay. Yeah, so pretty serious. That sounds so made up, it's not even funny. You already rejected me. Now you want to prank me? She's not making it up there on the way. Why the what hell do you do if someone's on the way to burn your house down? Herself? It doesn't make any sense. Because if you die, the school would indict me as the cause of the hate crime. You really gotta get out of here. Why wouldn't I just call the police? So they can show up 10 minutes after you're dead? Okay, where's the camera? There's no fucking camera! No MTV, no Ashton Kutcher, no... The Ashton Kutcher? What do we have to do to prove we're not making this up? Nah. How should I know? I don't know, just anything she wouldn't do to pull off a prank? Uh, fine. Kiss me. Oh, easy. Not you, herpes fully loaded. Oh, ew. I mean, Nicole has to kiss me. Why me? I thought you were mad at her. Oh, I am. I hate her. Nicole, you're a cold, corrupt, selfish, psychopathic bitch. Literally the most sadist fucking whore. I wouldn't be surprised if you like killing animals. Haven't tried. You don't even get mad at the assumption of that. You're severely twisted, evil, manipulative, Ew, and you some of you guys have herpes. Bitch. Doesn't Gross. mean I don't want you every waking moment of my sad fucking life. Excuse me? You show every sign of an abuser, and I don't give a shit. You're the kind of girl who'd choke me goodnight. The kind of girl who'd walk in on me cutting and take the razor blade and do it for me. I don't want a girlfriend to marry. I want a girlfriend who helps me plan my own suicide. You're that girl, Nicole, and I need you bad. Bitch, you need therapy. <laughs> okay, but she confessed her love for you. Are you gonna kiss her now? No way! Fuck this bitch! Why? She stole my excuse. I don't kiss depression posers. You are so petty. How else is she gonna bitch. believe this isn't a prank? 
My demand's final. We're here to save you right now. Shame that you hate being a homophobe more than I hate dying. Even if you're telling the truth, I don't care. You know what I want. Nicole, we lost five minutes doing this and she hasn't moved one inch from her house. Won't we see uh, them coming? What if we took you to the Super 8 and I kiss you in the lobby? The lobby? What am I, worthless? What? Do you want to hear yes? I'll get my shoes. No time, get in the car. Remember how being nice lands you in hostage friendships? Wait, it ended? Well, the fear of being blamed for inciting a hate crime lands you in hostage relationships. So, after her house burned down, it went from everyone in school hating me to everyone in school threatening to kill me. And I only had one option out. I've had to date Ari for the last two months so far, so they wouldn't think it was my fault. And I gotta keep this up for another six and hope she doesn't figure the charade out before graduation. What? She's really, 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 really fucking annoying, too. Do you wanna watch Heroes? No, I don't wanna watch fucking Heroes. Heroes sucks. Jekka's the only person who's in on it, and every day... See, there's homophobia here, but them burning our house down for being gay doesn't prove anything, okay? Obama's literally the president now. If a plane crashes, does that make 99.9% .9 of the rest of airplanes unsafe? Uh, yeah, that's what's what I heroes? thought. If it's so bad, she can move to Brooklyn, or wherever annoying people live after they graduate. We could be heroes! Is that, is that how it goes? We could be heroes. Are you still selling? Whipped cream hand jobs? Not sure if that was a limited time only thing like Pizza Hut 4 for all. <laughs> We could- You're a fucking bitch. Call me- Wait, who is this? Oh, Ari, gay one. Not sure they still let you have your phone in jail, but I guess you'll see this one later. Yeah, since you're in jail, I sold all your furniture, threw through your clothes at the shop, and have been renting out your room on Craigslist. You can visit every now and then, but you don't have a home here, so find a job and your own place. Recession shouldn't make it too hard. Wait, I wanna let you know I'm not mad at you or anything and still wanna hang out. She broke up with me, but that isn't why I'm texting. I just genuinely like you, not even for sexing, but because I think you're a good person on the inside. I want a real relationship that's cool with you. Oh, this is from Hunter. Hello, this is 911. Approximate wait time for a police officer is one hour. All texts from 9-11 are subject to a 25 cent service charge? I had to pay them money to tell them that they weren't even gonna be here on time for them to tell me that? God damn. There's a person here. Okay. I don't know what I'm gonna do tomorrow, man. I'm pretty upset. Let me try it one more time and see if it works. Let me let me see if it'll work. Nope, it's broken. Damn it. Not working. How did it break? I don't know. Just today, I tried to turn it on. It didn't turn on. I'm gonna take it to a. Given two gift subs in the channel. Ah, take it to a repair store this week. See what they could do about it, and then see what happens then. Anyways, Terraria is tomorrow. Terraria is. Oh, tonight. Tarai is tomorrow. I don't know what I'm doing tonight. Terraria is tomorrow. I don't know what I'm doing tonight. Yeah, anyways. Red Dead Redemption 2? Dude, if I start Red Dead 2, there's gonna be so many people that are like, Oh my god, 